January has been a slow month. So today we're hosting a subathon. We're going to stream for as long as it's needed based on how many subs we get. So we're going to start with a timer of four hours right now. Let me try to see if I have it here. Marathon timer. There we go. The timer has started, boys. We have four hours before the stream shuts down. Each sub adds uh, five minutes to the timer. Each 100 bits add one minute. And uh, hey, let's see how long we can go. If it's going to be 24 hours, that's fine. If it's going to be a week, I don't know. I'm going to try to stay as much as possible. It's an uncapped marathon, subathon. So uh, we're not going to shut down the stream. We're going to sleep on the chair. I don't know. We'll see if, if, if we cannot no longer hold it. But yeah. Uh, yeah, I tried yesterday's stockades. I managed to kill some mobs, but it's really, man, wow. Let me show you. Let, let me show you. Maybe you can give me some tips. I'll sub, but I would like more bubble content. Ooh, bubble content. We, we don't have the tools anymore, boys. So I logged into the game, and the first thing I see, I will give you a PP touch. That's what the name says. Nisa said, PP touch. What is a PP touch? Uh, hey, look, we have one of those uh, supply shipment. Well met. See you around. Very good. Let me try to find a buff. Uh, buff, please. Do I need a... the Iska, do I need a Darnassus buff? For stockades? Now let's find a druid. Or can I do it without? Travel and speed of life. Just stop me. You can do it without boon. Okay, that's what I wanted to know. Uh, let me thank the guy because he buffed me. Thank you. Let's find a, a druid now. I tried a bit yesterday for like 20 minutes or something. Buff, buff, me friend. I'm behind you. You use armor, pot, rejuve, pot, agility pot. Okay, um, what's the name of the armor pot? Uh, defense. Rejuve pot, agility pot, eh. Uh, Buff food, okay. So we just need a defense. Elixir of defense, that's good. Maybe one of those. Yo, Slay, thank you for the follow. Narage, thank you for the follow. Travel at the speed of light. Yo, mechanized Twitch TV with a tier 1 sub. Let's go, boys. We're above 4 hours. Adding 5 minutes to the timer. Thank you very much, mechanized. We're gonna see what we can do about bubble content um, for you. Thank you very much for the support. Let's go, boys. Baby. Thank you, friend. What a morning. Yo! An anonymous gifter with the two gifted subs to Granger Wow and Panachex. Four hours and ten minutes. Holy shit, guys. What if this stream goes like... Too long. You go for a 40 minute run to clear our mind. The Ikea drawer broke. No, the Ikea drawer. Not like that, man. I'm, I don't know what to say. I'm sorry. Go for a run, clear our head. That's a good point. Sub a ton until phase two. 
Oh, holy smokes. You think it's even possible? Has there ever been a subathon that long? It must have been, like... If you have, like, 1,000 viewers or 10,000 viewers... You can't even host a subathon. Those people will never let you go to sleep, man. Wow. Okay, let's use the pot. Yo! Naxerva! Na Naxerva. Thank you very much for the Prime Gaming. Let's go, boys! We start in power. We got a dude in Denmark. There's He got 297 days of his Sabaton. 297 day. Oh my god. How do you, how does he get so much, man? Okay, let's see. Um, I think we're good. Wow. Okay, let me try to figure out. We put this one first. I don't think we are supposed to do that. But it's been no better roses. And I came through. Oh, sorry. We. Oh, I just uh, reapplied one before it exploded. Oh, I'm out of mana. Wait a minute. What am I doing? I think I fucked up. Are they going to come back for me? This is not looking good, boys. I don't want to do this! Oh my god, what was that? What a mess, man. I don't know about this. Rumsey Dark is a secret sauce. 10 stamina, super cheap. I don't know. The Divine... Was the Divine Storm a rune quest hard? How many people do you think you need to bring? Nah, it's... It's soluble. Only getting the the first gem it's hard in the tower. It wasn't that hard. Just annoying. So what you want to do is to go from edge to edge at first to get them grouped up. Then you go up and down on the edge. On the left. Wait, here? Like this? Only this? You saw that level 30 elite demon. What level 30 elite demon? When they get half the way, you step off, like here.
Somebody. Somebody. What am I doing? Yeah, let's try this thingy here. So we're into the middle. We go down. Where do I go? Do I wake up? Okay, that's not good. Okay. Don't they have like an arcane one? What's that guy? He got stuck for fuck's sake. Oh. Was he gonna kill me? Most likely. Uh, does the horde start with gold? There's Discord, the trading game currency between realms. Well, you can get banned for that. Actually, uh, recently a streamer got banned for that. Um, what's his name? Guy the MMO. YouTuber. He traded um, 700 gold, I think. Okay, how do we pull until the next one? Fake UT? Yeah, Guy the MMO. He doesn't want to be fake anymore, I think. There's one mob. Whoa, we missed two mobs. We missed three mobs. How we cannot pull them, man? Look at that. That's weird. Oh shit. Oh, that was bad. Am I going to die? Maybe. Oh shit, this is not good. I don't know, dude. Could work. The first level will be scuffed, then you get used to it. You got the BFD bow on your hunter. It feels wrong. BFD bow. Something wrong with that music. Let me try to change it. Mm -hmm. 
Okay. Um, now what do we pull? The 2.9 speed bow. Oh, the, the blue bow from the first boss, I think. Try to pull from here somehow. Can we do them here? Have you guys tried on this once? Like here? I'm gonna try to. Actually. No? How about here? Hmm. Seem like. Why do we even kite them? How much do they hit for? Let me check. The combat. Rend. They have a lot of uh, rends. They do hit quite, of ha quite hard. Okay. I don't know. I don't really like it. It seems like... I know it's efficient and it's good, but it seems like cheesy and... Uh, uh. Like whenever you do the kiting with the blizzard, it, it feels like it requires a bit of skill, a bit of... Here is just like cheesiness and uh, let me try to see how can I uh, control the mobs. Maybe if I get to do it better, I will like it more. How many mobs can we pull? Three here couple of here. Let's see if we can pull four rooms at least. Okay, so we pull the one there. Then the one there. Okay. One. Two. Three. Four. Empty spaces. How much is that? Uh, oh my god. I think we pulled a lot of them though. Let's try to... Oh, this is not going to be good, boys. This is going to be interesting. Let me hope that uh, by putting more living bombs into them is going to create a nice environment for me to do a lot of damage. Oh my god. It's not looking good, boys. I'm going to die if I don't leave now. Did we kill any of them? We killed one. Hey. And the guy came from outside and he was like, Hey, wait a minute. Who are you? Let's aggro you. He has 7 HP. You will do much better if you learn the... Do you have a video, all Sublime? Like, you say here, right? But I don't know, how do you stack them perfectly? You know what's gonna... What, what's gonna... Like, the first level is gonna be easy. So you can learn, like, Cone of Cold. Once you get Cone of Cold here... I mean, Cone of Cold is gonna change everything, man. Kal Torak shows in a video. Okay, let's find that one on YouTube. Kal... To rock. Give you a link. Let's go. And then he has like improved blizzard. That's pretty smart, dude. Holy shit.
We need to get the stuff somehow, man. The stuff is gonna make me like, oh, baby. Do 20 quests for one level, turn it in wetlands, and then teleport to Stormwind. If you can do 90 mobs in 15 minutes, it's silly. Wow. That's that's crazy, guys. That's crazy. 90 mobs in 15 minutes. Uh, Iska, how many how many you do? Okay, let's see how he does the pulls, though. Because I pulled, like, four rooms. And this that was a big pull. Buy some elixir of firepower. Would that help? It's 10 spell power, though. Oh, it's more healing, is it? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. How do you get the elite portrait on a... Yeah, it's Leatrix Plus. You go in there, uh... Somewhere in the settings. Frame settings. Show player chain, it's called, the setting. Yeah, yeah, he does like me. Let me check. He goes there. He blinks. He probably uses the rest over leftovers. Hey, he loots. He loots. Loot. No, he didn't loot. And now he, he didn't do yet the... He has the boon, though, you see? The boon helps a lot, though. I think. Does it? Do you actually have to climb up or do you just have to get close? That's what I don't understand. He did, did he use an explosive or something? Oh my god, dude. What's going on there? So he's, he's running Improved Blizzard. And I think he's running Fingers of Frost Rune. Let me check what he's running. No. He's using dynamite, dynamite occasionally. What kind of dynamite he has? He does, does speed the process. Oh my god. Man, this is like next level. I, I think I would like that. So do we go for improve... We would need 11 points here. For that. It does speed up the process because you can slow them down. He's not using finger frost. No, no, because you need like, uh, you need regeneration. Keeps you alive. Okay. We don't have the buff. We're kind of slow. Look at that. But I think we're going to try to... To try to gather them like properly. And not be stubborn, because I sometimes can be stubborn. You know what the stubborn burden is? It's me. Don't you see? And how about the other side mobs, guys? Um, oh, shit. This is not going to be good. Oh, that was bad. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Oh my god, I'm going to die. No. Ah! Ah! No! You need the boon? Well, okay, let's go get the boon. Let's go get the boon. Do we get the blizzard as well? We go frost and we get like... Let me go back to the video and see what kind of um, intro. Hey guys, Cal. Hey guys, Cal Torak here. Hey, Cal Torak. Cal Torak. It, it sounds like he's like from Game of Thrones from season one with Cal Drogo. This is Cal Torak here. I am the blood warrior of Cal Drogo. And I want to take Khaleesi for myself. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> you do it without Boon. Mm -hmm. You use prototype, but yours not that bold. It's prototype, yeah. No, I, I, I made a stupid pull. Like, you, you cannot misclick here, you know. Good idea to learn it without boon because you will probably die a bunch. True. So if we go to to do the boon and then we die, 
We learn the good stuff yet, and then we get the boon. And then to make sure we get ready for the February launch, we're gonna do 10 hours of this. We're gonna do 10 hours of stockage farm. We're gonna make like a couple of hundreds of gold. We might boost some viewers, maybe. We'll think about it. Maybe not. Who knows? It's February 8th, dude. It's February 8th and it's gonna be crazy. It's gonna be crazy. The problem is whenever you don't have a boon, whenever you pull mobs from the back, it's gonna take a while. And the other side, do you actually do the other side too? Because the other side is gonna pull mobs that stun you. You're pumped, you main a rogue. Are you gonna play combat? Okay, let's see. One, two, and we're gonna use uh, one of these too. Okay. I think those strong, strong blood potion can be helpful too. Six health every five seconds. Um, let's watch a bit more of the video, okay? From Kal Torak. Kal Torak here. Today, I want to bring you what is hopefully my final stockades video. I have pretty close to perfected my route for 25 to 31, and I'm very happy about it. I can do pulls over 20 mobs now pretty clean. I didn't think it would be possible to solo full clear this fast until I got a few levels, but the fact that I can already do this at 25 has me really excited for phase launch. I do want to preface this by saying I am geared to the teeth. Yeah. I am very close to full phase bis. I'm mm. missing a ring, helm, and pants for full bis. The helm and pants I currently have are both second best in slot raid loot, so I'm pretty stacked. I will not be going over all the basics for this farm, as I have three other videos going over it more in detail. If you are new to the stockades farm... You know what? I think, uh... We get new bracers. Do we have the fire bracers on this guy? More heal, right? More damage. I don't think I have the fire bracers. Frost. Do we get this one as well? Seven spell power of the belt. Stamina int more important when learning. Do we get the coarse dynamite with us? Or do we need uh, the, the heavy dynamite? I think the heavy dynamite would be better. Let me try to get the belt. We're gonna lack a lot of stamina. We're gonna beg for some buffs, though. Hello. The first level is gonna be hard. 100%. So we wanted this. An arcane wand would be good also, but we don't have it on this one. We have it on the other mage. We have some dynamite with us. Okay, never mind. What professions do you have on this one? Skills. Engineering, tailoring. Okay. You don't use dynamite yet, but it can speed up the process. So let me check uh, what we were here. Bracers. Uh, fire. Fire. Phoenix. Uh... What? Not fans. Phoenix. Phoenix bindings. Why is there one gold man here? Is this a scam? This is a little scam. Phoenix gloves. Phoenix pants. Why is this such a scam? Uh, we put uh, three intellect on them, right? Let me check. Fire, power. Elixir of fire. What's the name of the elixir of fire? Let me check quickly here. Dungeons and raids, crafting, tailoring. No, no. Uh, <laughs> Enchanting, 
wrists. We need a uh, superior stamina. Oh, no, 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 no. Lesser intellect. It's greater astral essence, two of them. It's firepower. Ah, okay. Let's get some firepower, which is 10. Defense. Let's get some defense. We're not going to die again, right? Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Elixir of defense. And we're going to buy some... Uh, what did we say? Greater... Greater ast Astral Essence. Two of them. Put uh, some enchant on the bracers. Very well. Ramsey Dark Run. And that gets you drunk. Get you drunk inside my trunk. My trunk, my trunk. My little drunky trunk. Get up, boys. How much spell power we have? 102. My god. And now? A hundred and fifteen. Oh my god. And then we're gonna use those two. Let's find someone to put three intellect in the bracer. Does anyone here that um, sells like any enchanter? There's no more coffee in my uh, bag. <laughs> no. Yo! Marco himself with the five gifted subs. Adding 25 minutes to the subathon, boys. By the way, if you just tune in today, we, today we're hosting the Sunday Subathon. We're going to be streaming for as long as you guys want. If you want to add timer to the stream, there are 4 hours and 12 minutes left. Each subs adds 5 minutes. Each 100 beats adds uh, 1 minute. So, um, we're going to be on for as long as it takes. Let's find quickly uh, Enchanter. Marco, thank you very much for the support, my friend. Where, where is... Um... Let's go. Yeah, wish for buff me, please. Please. You have the stuff. I don't have the stuff. Dude, we should get the stuff. Should, should we run some BFD? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. T. Let's find a priest quickly. Little priest. -a. Can't find a priest. There are no priests. There is no buff. Man, aren't people playing priests? Well, you make shadows so bad and then you, you wonder why there aren't any priests. Yo, Iska! With the gifted subs to Joey! Thank you very much, Iska. Let's go! 4 hours and 16 minutes left in this grand adventure. Let's try. Uh, do we reset? Let's reset the, the dungeon also, right? Reset all dungeons? I can't find a priest anyway. Insane. You know what? We can do it without the buff from Priest. Yo, is that the Priest? Nope. Let's just go. We, we didn't even get like on the Bracers. <laughs> buff, please. Break that, brothers. Come on, Tarandi. Buff me up. Buff me up before you go, go. Little IFK ish. Twitch chat bugged. How is it bugged? Priests are at the Sunday church. Check the cathedral. Okay, we have buffs, boys. We have buffs. Let's put the elixir. We res resetted the dungeon. We got, like, uh, firepower. We have a total of 125 uh, fire damage. We put pull two rooms. Two rooms, it's doable, right? It should be doable, two rooms. You know what? Let's use this one, too. We use everything we have. We have a... Uh... Okay. Tali dead with the Twitch Prime. Thank you very much. Let's go, 420. Actually, I have an idea.
Oh my god, what am I doing? I got outside shit you need world buff well you need to learn it first take my little mage my prime little mage thank you very much we got out uh, by mistake it seems like we we struggle here a bit let's watch a bit more the video what happened okay farm i recommend checking out those videos before diving into this one oh this my god this is my god. current build i'm using for talent. So he's playing um, frost damage. Uh, extra, extra armor from here. It improve frost nova if you fuck up permafrost for the blizzard. Cold snap for another nova if you want to escape and not lose your buffs. It's safer this way. Okay. Once I'm doing this as frost. I'm not running the shatter fingers of frost build, but I will be once I am a higher level and can afford mana shield more. Okay. For runes, I am using Living Bomb, Living Flame, and Regeneration. While I can full clear without Regeneration right now, one bad daze or one misstep off the ledge can mean instant death. I run Regeneration as a safety net right now to prevent annoying deaths, and can still find myself dying with it sometimes. For pulls, my goal is to get as many mobs as I possibly can. The more mobs you have, the better it feels. The reason behind this is because you can chain cast Living Bomb without having to wait for it to fall off targets. And I'll literally try and pull as many mobs as I possibly can. If I could pull every room, I would. But days or mobs catching up to me usually prevents that. You'll often see me using healing potion now instead of mana pots, because I'll try and be as greedy as possible with my pulls, taking some extra damage while I squeeze in an extra pull or two. World buff is required to do this. You won't be able to escape mobs without the 20% move speed. For the juggle phase, I am no longer opening with living flame unless I need the healing immediately. I have found that sending Living Flame after 7-8 to eight Living Bombs is usually better. Reason for this is because Living Flame is up during the kill phase. Since we are using Improved Blizzard, Living Flame being active is massive. The Improved Blizzard will keep most of the mobs stacked in the Living Flame and the Explosions yeah, this makes will kill sense. most of the mobs before they can run away. Before casting Blizzard, make sure to step off the ledge, get the mobs running towards you, then step back onto the ledge and cast Blizzard. This will make the mobs take the longest path to you and guarantee you get a full channel Blizzard off. I am having some pretty clean kill phases now, and a lot of the time I'm not even having to mana pot or dynamite. Alright, let's go over the route. Like I said before, I try and pull as much as I possibly can, but one bad daze may require you to give up on pulling extra rooms and force you to run to the front. Do not try and force these big pulls if you get dazed early. It will likely lead to your death. Always make sure you are checking the rooms you have previously pulled for stragglers, as you can scoop these guys easily later. My first pull I try and get the entire middle hallway, the middle end room, Wow, this is the first pull, the green one. In one of the front middle side rooms. Pull two, I try and clear some of the mobs in the left hallway. And, and let's see the start. Greedy. There we go. He got really, really greedy, this. So he, he almost lost, like, he has 300 HP, he almost lost his world buff. Okay, you have to move faster, that's what I'm saying. But then I have to move my living blom bomb to one on the mouse. Okay, we're gonna put with the mouse the living bomb. Let's try again. Am I dead? Not yet. Let's go. So, um... Put this one, like this. And let's try to do at least all the way until here.
Why does that guy have like full HP? I don't understand. Dude. Living blonde. This is like so so scuffed. Uh, did they kill all of them? <laughs> Almost died. We need more healing potions, that's for sure. The thing is that only one level is going to be scuffed at 25. Because once you get 26 men with Cone of Cold, you're going to be able to do better pulls. You're going to be able to control them. Okay. Do we try another pull? I think we should. Four rooms. Do we take four rooms, guys? <clears throat> I think four rooms would be a good idea. Try to figure out if we pull that one, it's gonna pull the other one. Oh shit. Wait, I couldn't. I couldn't target like the one that I wanted. Ah! Can't attack him, look at that. Do two and learn to stack them. Oh boy. So we missed three, four, five. Can we do five? And learn to stack them. Behind the portal is uh, LOS. Okay. <clears throat> hey, they dropped three silver each. That's pretty, pretty good, isn't it? Use your frostbolt for the first pull. Uh, why? Is a living bomb too expensive? Okay. But I think we're good here. I was uh, scuffed, but what we're trying to do here is to learn to pull. Okay. Why is this guy still on me? 
You see, he came like on me. They don't go back, man, if they come on this side. This is so bad. You are also too far forward. You want to be right against the port uh, pillar. Like uh, close to the this one. <clears throat> Closer to the portal. Mm. Okay, let's try that. I mean, it's even like this, it's not bad, but compared to what he was doing, Kaltorak, he's gonna get like. 25 to 31 with the pull she's doing. And probably... Let's say... Um, two hours, maybe? Um... I can't, I can't, man, I, I can't, I swear. Okay, that's a start. It's not the best one, but it's a start. <laughs> Run straight outside, boys. I don't know what's wrong with me. <clears throat> Bring a holy nova priest. Don't move the camera. Yeah, but I have, like, habits. I play with moving the camera a lot. Okay, that's good enough for me. Okay. You had the same habits? Yeah. But the mobs. Oh, they're coming, boys. We can start with this uh, side here. Okay, we... we ooh, 300 HP. I'm dead. I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. Cause I don't want to do this. It's cheeky and bad. You spent like six hours to get it down. Are you playing a human or a gnome? 
Hm? <lacht> ja. Naum. You heard it's easier on human. I've heard the opposite, but I, I don't understand why. There were some fights in the past that were harder on Gnome, for example. To tell you the truth, I'm trying to imagine a place where um, you can actually slowly kind of con kite the mobs and just just finish them without the ledge after level 26. Let's do a couple of more tries. It's too early to give up, boys. It's too early. Oh my god, I'm going to aggro this shitter. No. Okay. Let's get one pack down then. Ba, 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 ba. Okay, so let's see. You say this is it, right? If they come all the way up here, then they don't go back down. That's the problem. You don't let them go. It's like this. I don't know what happened there, because... Wait, look, we got outside. What the fuck? Nothing. Why? Hold here, yeah. I do have 985 HP with the well-fed buff. Ooh. Okay. Trying to do it as Frost was making it harder for you? Well, it's all have to do with the binds and... What am I doing? Man, I'm going outside. What is this shit? <laughs> oh my god. This is something totally new. Uh, this is, doesn't have to do with the old way of playing the mage. Look, I got the stun. So, this is it, right? I, I, don't, I don't understand. Like, it's, it's so, so bad, man. 
So this is what you play with them. Let's see. One, two. Put this. And go up. We died. I'm sorry, guys, but this is a cringe grind. Like... It, it's bad. You're not moving enough. No, it's not. I don't think I'm moving it correctly. I think I was getting better results with moving from left to right. To tell you the truth. I was getting better results with moving from left to right. And um, I start to believe that maybe Blizzard might be a, an option here. Getting the mobs, putting a couple of living bombs. Um, then using um, living flame. And then Blizzard, once they're about to flee. You've learned the Mara 1 pull. This is easy. Yeah, but I didn't like the Mara 1 pull either. The only thing that I liked was the... Um... Is anyone doing it with a human? In the chat? Human female? And doing it consistently. What's your opinion if girlfriend says no gaming at all? Not for one minute. Sell all gaming setup or I'm leaving. No, if someone behaves like that with you in life, I'm not sure if it's worth spending a life with someone like that. I don't know. There's always, <laughs> like, more, uh, backstory to it. But, um... Do you want a girlfriend or a mother? And how much is your fault for her behaving like that? Okay. There are more things to... than meet the eye. Doesn't work, man. Look at that. One. It might be a thing with the. Um... Let's put this one. One. Two. I don't know. It, it feels like human doesn't work. Okay. There we go. We have to go like further. Ah, so it's a longer like Look this one doesn't go back Might need to go big back Almost got outside again Look how close we are from Getting outside I, I don't like this man Don't let them touch the wall. Can I pull the boss as well there? Or does he have like a bigger window? Hey, 
Exclamation add-ons in the chat if you want to know about my add-ons. You think SFK farm is easier and even more worth? Well, there's a couple of advantages for this one. It's in Stormwind. You can learn new spells here. You can vendor outside. Um, yeah, you know. Where's the big boss? Can I pull it? No, I don't like this thing, man. This is the cheesiest thing I've ever seen. Like, this is like going from some class that was powerful to like a beggar. Like, I don't like this farm. It's like, it's so, so bad. Like, Blizzard managed to make it in such a way that they took something beautiful and they went like, how do we destroy the AoE farm of the mage? Give them this. I, I can't do shit like this, man. I'm sorry. This is like... I understand the face tanking system because I kind of like the face tanking system. You need to jiggle the left corner more left and right. You are not moving enough. You mean like this? Yeah, but the face tanking at least doesn't make you like cheating ledges was never like a big fan of my grinds i've only done them for a bit even the zg farm the mara pool i've done it once or twice and zulfarak i only used to level my characters like i used to like aoe farming but straight up like do a big pull. I used to like a lot AoE farming, like kiting mobs in a circle. Like in DM East, if you guys remember the farms or um, the demons in DM East. Or the Zulfarak uh, grind when it came to opening the graves and farming them straight up. Let's try to cheese more left, more right. Zombies. BRD as well, yeah. Let's see. What the fuck, man? I got outside. This is making me annoyed. We want it. We want to 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 learn how to jiggle the mobs. That's the idea here. So this is the idea. You go here. And then you move more. There you go. So this is the way. Basically. You still get hit sometimes. But you have to go like further out like this. You still get hit sometimes. And maybe we need to stay a bit back.
Mm-hmm. As soon as they you, they start running you, you go to you go back to wall. Hey, what? And let's see. I'm gonna catch up to me, boys. Hey, Ian, How's the grind going? We're just trying to learn this a bit. But I don't think we're gonna do it. I think I'm going to choose to play with people in a dungeon. That's called panic voice. Now what? We're out of mana. And a bunch of mobs coming towards us. Might be worth doing it, Prot Pala. Three men with the healer. And the meta start for fastest 40 will be spell cleave. Three mages plus priests spamming stocks into uh, SM. You think stockades? I don't think stockades uh, It's the question. It's the answer. <laughs> it's the question. Because stockades, you kill it too fast. Uh, and um, you're going to be locked out. Especially if you do like three mages or four mages. You don't really need a priest, I think. Only mage is enough. Like three mages should be enough to do massive pulls and... Uh... I think a tank would be better though. I think RFK. So the, the fastest leveling would be to get like 20 quests and then uh, go um, get one level, 26 if it's possible, in one go from the quest. Then learn your Cone of Cold and go into RFK. Straight up.
And having close to refill consumes and stuff, it's hard to compete with. Sixty-five mobs in twelve minutes is a uh, fantastic pace. I guess so. Let's see if we get uh, that one. What am I doing? Getting dazed. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait a minute. What am I? Did the mobs respawn? Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> the mobs respawn, boys. I was like, where am I going? 78k XP per hour. Mm. So I, I think I got a better clue on doing them the the regular way where you kite from left to right. I think I was better at doing them that way. <clears throat> so what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to try to develop some new muscle memory. So I'm going to apply a living bomb with uh, nine. On my mouse. I'm not gonna feed you, Shmoot. Shut the fuck up, please. I have Arcane. I think eventually improved Blizzard will be better. But a lot of things from here don't really help me. Arcane Focus doesn't help me. Arcane Subtlety doesn't help me. One damage can help me at the end, sure. Clear casting is good in one damage. But we don't spam that much arcane explosion. Did you guys actually try to face tank them though? Doesn't it work to, to face tank them? Oh no, because you get stunned, right? Face tank won't work. Because of the stun or because of... You can face tank them with duo mobs. Mm, the right side mobs are scary, okay. Can fap each pool. It's gonna be expensive. Well, not expensive, like... Listen, I think only the first level is gonna be harder here, if you level here. Once you get 26, once you get 27... The spells will do like more damage, you will have more HP. You will get like uh, new spells. And mostly like, probably only only Cone of Cold is what you want from here. I think Cone of Cold can change everything or Mana Gem at 28. Oh, yes. By the faps right now, they'll go up. You think so? I think a lot of people will save the ton hundreds of thousands of faps. Let's try to do once more this. Okay, so not all the mobs respawned. Just the one from the middle. Shit. Okay, let's try to go all the way there. Oh shit, I moved my keybind. What did I do, man? I used my pot and I get out. It, trying to build new muscle memories now, it's it's kind of cringy. I can't. I think the more health would help more here. 13 spell power is quite a lot, so we're gonna keep that one. But we're gonna get 8 stamina here from the belt. And 3 more int. Rather than 7 spell power. <laughs> also, um, it seems to me like um, having all the elixirs, uh, armor elixirs and so on, would probably help. Man, what's going on? Oh my god, what the fuck? 
biggest thing is the boon. Yeah, the boon gives us uh, speed. I think we should try go get the boon and come back. But it's a kind of early here. We can try on a... Well, we have a horde mage. Never mind. Oh my god, what am I doing? What the fuck am I doing, man? I was doing better at the first uh, moment when we started this. First, it gets worse before it gets better. So what we're gonna do is probably we're gonna do one hour of uh, practicing every day. And um, we're gonna get better with time. Let's go again. Yeah, this guy shipped. We try here again. I'm st I'm dazed, man. What the fuck? Oh my god, he, they hit me. They hit me hard. Bang, bang. They... Ah! Okay. Jesus Christ, man. My life. It's gonna be a dead death. Tap da 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 da. This looks like a pretty bad farm. It's not a bad farm. And yeah. look, let me show you someone who does it like efficiently here. But you probably have to practice for like ten or twenty hours. So let's let me show you here. Okay. He doesn't even seem to be. He doesn't even go on the ledge. Is, do you notice that? Not sure how many mobs are there, but there are like 10 mobs at least, probably. In one pool. He doesn't go up on the ledge. So with the gnome... You see, I go on the... I think with the gnome, you don't get on the ledge. You don't need the... Uh, how do you call it? Is this guy gonna... You don't need the buff. You can do it. Let me show you. I can kill them all. Like right now. It's not a big problem. It's gonna be a bit scuffed.
<coughs> Honey for me. Uh, BTS, please. Oh my god, what am I doing? <laughs> oh my god, that was the worst whatever. Okay, I think we had enough for today uh, when it comes to BFD farms. We're gonna do some BFD runs, boys. Let me check if we have anything available right now. Hunter LFG. Need one healer. One feral druid, two male DPS. Wait. Uh, should we join with the paladin quickly? Two male DPS. Nothing reserved. Double MSOS. Why not? The hit you are tanking is because you move too slow from side to side. We're gonna come back and try with the world buff as well. Standing still is the, um, the source of the problem. How many hours do you have, Iska, so far in doing this? Need Paladin. Fifty plus hours? Oh my god. How many mobs you killed per uh twelve minutes? So it's not a bad grind, if if you get it nice. But I think uh, I think it's probably not worth for me to learn it, because um, during launch I would prefer to have a group. So I'm gonna make a group. Yeah, exactly. Like if 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 it, if if it would be the beginning of the phase, I would probably try to struggle to learn it. Everything you can learn, like all the farms that I've done in the past, eventually it feels like you hit a wall, but then eventually... Oh, wait a minute, let's start down. Yeah, full clear in 19 minutes is not bad. Like, if you're looking at Cal Torak guy, he's doing like 15 minutes, 19 mobs, but I don't think he's doing the bosses. But if you do it for money, I think the extra bosses might be worth, maybe, if they drop something. What was the name? Double. Something double was the name of the... Now we have the the runes on the paladin. We can... Slash V double. In please. Let's see what kind of group is this. Because I told him to save a place for me. Okay, we have one warrior, two rogues, and... Uh, and four casters. And a hunter. Sounds good. I mean... I don't have time to make a group myself to... We now have uh, more runes though. We have Divine Storm. We have uh, Exorcisms. We we have a uh, Crusader Strike. Crusader Strike. Let me, let me see if I can inspect anyone here. We don't have the, the buff, the world buff though. No, let's buff some... We have some consumes. Hey, we have the 5% buff. Can anyone drop a world buff at this hour? Max level Enchanter. What is his name? Antori. Okay, let's see. A chest, one stats. Uh, have we sold our bracers? We used to have, like, Jorgen bracers on the auction house. My question is, have we sold them? No, they didn't sell. Should we keep them, guys? What do you think? Or should we try to, to sell them? Yesterday, we got drop of them. It's 6 strength, 3 agility.
Let's see if we try to sell the Jorgen Bracers. Oh, 33 gold. Hey, let's try to sell them. Heavy stone. Clay ring of regeneration. We have two faps. I'm gonna buy more faps in case... Uh, but I don't think we need... Oh, look, faps is 20 silver on my server. That's interesting. Let's buy some more goblin double... Gobl goblin double clams. Okay, anything else we want from here? Waystone. No, because we don't need waystone. We can destroy this one. We no longer use them. Okay, mount. Stuff to make bandages. Red bun ore. Uh, we wanted to make an enchant on the chest, one stats. And um, we're going to get them later. Let's focus on... We have everything we need for the BFD. Let me check what we need. Uh, apparently, we need one feral druid. For... Uh, yep, 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 one feral. Hey, we got the boon! Let's go! Uh, buy a reagent vendor. Con boon displacer. And let's head over. Oh shit, there's going to be a Ashenvale fight before. Can we hit at least two bo mobs? Let's see. Quickly fly there. I think we're missing some spells or something. Hey, how do you think? This is my new paladin. We just got like, we have one day played on him. So this is what we have so far. We have the pants, we have the boots, we have the seal of rain, the Warsunga trinket. We have the Vergan's fist. Cloak from yeah, helmet, neck. It's not bad. It's pretty good. We're gonna fly first to Oberdin because we have a quest there which gives us a new pair of racers. And I think we wanna take them. <clears throat> Yo, Jorgen Bracer sold for 33 gold, guys. Look at that. Was that a good choice because we didn't equip them? Uh, who knows? Maybe they're going to be bis at level 40 as well. <laughs> Jorgen Bracers. Pretty good at this level, though. 6 strength, 3 agility, 3 stamina. I'm going to be right back, guys. Now, today we're hosting, by the way, a Sabaton. Uh, so we have 3 hours and 25 left from the stream. You can see the timer above my uh, webcam him here. So every sub... Uh, gifted sub or prime sub adds five minutes to the timer. Bits, every hundred bits adds one minute to the timer. Oh, thank you very much. The we... avocado sucks. The avocado sucks? It is too tough? Uh, either not uh... mm, ripe enough, huh? Ripe or black. Mm. Thank you. Warson Gross. Warson Gulch Bracers. Are those from um, Exalted? Get right back one second. Actually. Yo, soft hands with a prime gaming. Thank you very much. Let's go, boys. Three hours and 29 minutes. Mm, soft hands. Feel free to browse. What is this portal? Portal to Zoram Strand. What? A suggestion for a warlock name. Um, Harry Daughter. I am Go in peace. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Harry Daughter. Summon stone. <laughs> No, one mage went offline. We need a feral, by the way. Does this work? Oh, we have a portal. No way. I didn't know about this. Go back, taking a bio.
Oh, we find the fennel. But we lost the priest, I think. No. We found the fennel. Baddy. Baddy. And let me check who we lost. We lost the priest, probably. Need one healer priest. We're gonna use this one, right? The battle hymn. Oh, we're parsing. We are going to parse. Phase 2. Phase 2 goes live in 8th of February. 8th of February. I don't know why he wants to duel me, man. Chat. Did I win or he? I don't know how to deal with a paladin, man. Give me a break. I win. <laughs> <laughs> Stack, please. Can't seem to find that priest, man. The last thing we need. Having some oatmeal. Where is the priest, man? The priest. Wait, if we enter the dungeon right now, we're not going to get credit for the event. But I think um, we're going to lose the event. Maybe. The two horde battle mass are remaining. Yeah, we're probably going to lose this one. So let's just go. You are not prepared. I think... um. Let me check. 8th of uh, February is going to be... What day is going to be? Let me try to see how we work with the calendar. February 8th is going to be a Tuesday. A Thursday. Thursday. So I would assume it's probably after the maintenance. Maybe after the maintenance. Azamus has a new video with new class.
What's Batty doing? Oh shit. Oh, he's okay. Main tent is, um, okay. Is this oatmeal made with milk or with water? Seems like milk. Warlock, if it's a tank, what do we give him? Uh, wisdom, right? Okay. Let's check the warrior. He needs a two-handed epic sword. That's for sure. Doesn't need the gloves, though. So, uh, we're good there. Mm. Hey, I think I need to get that belt. No. Is that a male belt? Here? There's a leather one. So where do we get another belt if not from... I just don't think we're gonna get one. Pretty much. Oh, never mind. There is one. 7 strength, 9 stamina. Twilight Defender Girdle. I've never seen it drop probably. That's why. Want help getting this after this VFD? The belt? Um, let me think a bit about it. Oh, we have two mages. One is a healer. Okay, food is here. Mm. I've been working out every day since the start of New Year. There might have been a day where I worked up like less, only did like stretching and a couple of push ups, or only walked on a treadmill. But I'm starting to feel not my muscles anymore, and I don't I don't get sore muscles anymore. But I do get because sometimes I, I I open new muscles that I never used before. But what I'm trying to say is that <sighs> I'm in a lot of pain. I think I need to let my body recover. I'm no longer I'm no longer getting the same amount of uh, rest from my sleep. It's sustainable, but it's crazy. My cat, my cat wants food. And he meows until he gets it. So, um... 
It's sustainable. Probably not recommended. Bilbo's Baggins. Seasonal Discovery Phase 1 was the um, most crappy wow patch out there. Really? Oh, wow. Really? I can't think of other ones that were worse. Oh my god, I'm healing like... Okay, everyone here. Am I a buff bot by any chance here? Oh my god, this is not good. Options, add-ons, not running, spell list, blessing of might. Which one is this one? The 35 one. Um, why do I have them still here? How do I set up this? Oh shit. For AOE buffs, condensing timers to prevent spam. Let's check if this works. Save, close, yes, nice. Let's go. So, what's the rotation, guys, on uh, the Paladin? I don't know. Don't have Rebuke anymore, so stay chilled, guys. I think we forgot the um, agility elixir. Now I know what we forgot. Now this is officially the first raid where we actually have runes. We're trying to figure out uh, our rotation. If we can. Slash loot also. Let's put this one here. <coughs> what a mess it is here. Actually, let's put this one here. And then this one here. Uh, rotation is right-click mob. Wait until dead. Uh, I guess that's a good one. Okay. Um, let's rebuff a bit. I think we should be fine, to be honest. We should be fine. Um, armor Aura? No one is getting hit from my uh, group. Concentration? No. Yo! 
Mr. Slugsnail with the 10 gifted subs. Thank you very much. Holy smokes, we're back to four hours, boys. We're back to four hours. How much was that? 50 minutes. Let's go, baby. Guys, today we're running a subathon. Each subs add five minutes to the stream. We're gonna stream for as long as it's needed. Okay, let's go. Let's pump. I forgot to reapply a uh, seal of wisdom. Seal of wisdom. What is that? Oh no, I need to go down, right? How much until? Is it on me? Why? We can't pump, mate, because of that. Well, there goes my parse voice. Oh, wait a minute, what? Is this like a uh, master looter? <laughs> oh, we got a pair of bracers, I think. Yo, Palik, with the Prime Gaming for two months, welcome back. Thank you very much for the continued support. We have the necklace, right? Yeah, we can pass on that. Oh my god, look at this. It's gonna be huge. Uh... Look at the mage pumping. I'm not doing well, guys. Um, for leveling, uh, I think uh, whatever you can get your hands on. Sometimes int with stamina is good. Sometimes uh, spell power is good. Just have to make a judgment call. For example, on my mage, I have a belt with 8 stamina, 8 intellect. Right? And I have a belt with also with uh, 7 spell power and 5 intellect. So that 8 stamina for me is huge because I do multiple AoE pulls. And sometimes it keeps me alive, right? So, um, yeah, let's put this one here so you guys can actually see the rolls. When they drop. So for me, it would be better, basically, to have a, a balanced stack, uh, stats for leveling. Sometimes you get blue items that have three stats. They have stamina, intellect, and spirit. And if you compare that to a pure spell power thing, I guess you always have to choose like some sort of balance between them. Another thing which is important... <clears throat> Yo, Invisible Fire, thank you very much for the Prime Gaming. Oh, five more minutes, guys, let's go! We're drawing all the Primes from... Uh, oh, shit. Wait, I'm not ready yet because I need to buff everyone. So, um, it depends how you level as well. If you level only single target, then maybe spell power is better. But I guess a mage never really levels only single power. A single... Uh... Man, I can't... Okay, whatever, cool. I don't think I'm gonna pump here, boys. The damage seems to be low on Paladin on this boss fight. Hey, let's use Exorcism. I forgot we can use it on our rotation. I just realized now. Am I going to run out of mana? No, I think so. Not on this fight. Someone died. It was a tank. Let me try to... Use uh, this one. Can I, can I grab aggro here? Look, 500 damage. That was nice. 500 damage? Yeah. The hunters are... Uh, bop the mage. Oh shit, I have bop. I forgot about that.
Who needs a warlock tank when a hunter pet can uh, do a good job? If you know what I mean. <laughs> I'm going to die here, right? It's bubble. Okay. We have the Arbalest and the... Okay. Crossbow and Cape. I don't think we needed anything from this uh, this boss. Who's rolling? Oh, okay. The Hunter is rolling the... Let me check. The boss we have here. Gamura. Um... No, I don't think anything is good. Maybe the next one has something good. We have the male legs. I guess the one-hander is nice, but if the rogues need it, I'm gonna pass it. I need a one-hander, so... The strength of purpose, I think that one I'm gonna take. For tanking, which one do we need? Hey, the six strength, six stamina ring. Fine, let's go get it. Mega crash. Oh, the shield would have been good, right? I didn't even notice. Where's the shield? Isn't it from here? I oh, know, it was Gamura. Yeah, the 12 strength shield I think would have been a good option. Get the quest shield. I have it. I have it. I have it. Uh, definitely. 735, yep, 725, yep. Oh, with the Paladin, I think I'm gonna level in dungeons. And I'm going to tank a bit. Better just to tank with a two-hander as a Paladin anyway. Uh, that's the meta this phase, definitely. I wonder if it would be the same for like big pulls with a mage in a dungeon. Maybe getting cons Consecration. And... Um, Man, buffing every five minutes is like... Next level. It's torment. Not, not sure which is worse. Buffing everyone? Or... Uh, or making water for them. <laughs> With a mage. I think making water is worse. I like your videos, man. Hey, Kalot. You coming from YouTube? Welcome to the stream, my dude. You should not be here. Come on, man. Stack them up. What are they doing? No stack, no pump. Watch your feet. Look at the feral pumping. I'm not doing a lot of damage. I expected Paladin to do more damage. Dodge, parry, miss. Watch your feet. Oh, I, I don't use like... Damn it, exorcism. Ooh, the trident. And uh, the, 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 the...
We got a pole arm, boys. I'm not sure if it's better than... Uh... Oh, we got a ring. Let's go. Um, nice. Upgrade. Let's try to see if it's good. Perry, miss. It's a lot of extra crit, isn't it? Whoa, why, why is it only six? Because we don't have the skill, I think. Let me check how much skill is with the maze. With the maze, is 10%. It's because of the skill. I think the skill counts, uh, like, a lot. It's a big part of this. The very gun is still better. Because of the 12 agility. I don't have skill. I can't really prove it now. But it's because of the speed, right? Yeah, no skill, guys. We can't. Four strength, uh, seven stamina versus four agility, seven stamina. I think the four strength one, right? How much skill do we have in pole arms? Are we going to use pole arms? Anyway. 23 out of 122. Yeah, let's just use the maze for now. No skill. We actually want to make a contribution here. Vendor strike. Humans have improved maze, yes. But um, the, the, the maze doesn't have really good stats. Wow, did you see that 415 white crit, man? Wow, that was huge. I can't. I am... Dick Shield Clam. No. Let's try to buff everyone before the fight. We're gonna run out of mana. So let's just drink now then. Double kill. Oh. Where's the other rogue? One rogue is offline. You think he went offline because he he missed the roll on the on the ring? Did he say anything? Didn't say anything. What's the weak order above the target frame? Exclamation nug running. No, exclamation it's nug running, that's the name of the add-on.
Is there any rogue loot of this boss? Let me check. Gelly has. Um, yeah, it's the Z bonus. Ooh, the all gay uh, gauntlets. I want the all gay gauntlets. This would be so cool to get them. The all gay gauntlets. All gay. Like the ones from the... Seaman. Seaman. Do you know what Seaman is? On the Seaman, they grow algae. And you can pick them and eat them. What? Sorry, my it's my accent. I think we have to use on cooldown. Uh, oh shit! Do I just have like? Oh shit! I have righteous fury on. That's not good. I don't think I'm helping uh, the tank with righteous fury on. I can't really cancel this one, that's the problem. I click right click on it, but it doesn't work. So I'm not sure exactly what's going on there. Shadow Strike on Frost. That's not good, right? I'm definitely not helping the tank, man. Should I heal the tank? I think I should heal the tank somehow. Oh shit, I should heal myself. Dex? Let me, let me heal myself, like... Okay. I'm sorry, I'm not sure... I'm playing usually caster. Is this going to be a 5-7 group? I'm actually curious. Not good idea to tank this one, I think. Oh no, I'm being feared. We got a Twilight Slayer tunic. And another Agility Stamina Intellect uh, tunic. I don't think that's good for me, right? Uh, the tunic. Black Boiled Leather. 9 Agility, 10, uh, 11 Stamina, 7 Intellect. Nah. It's shite, boys. It is oh, I forgot one boon, man. Forgot to unboon. Dust to dust angle. Ross, remember to sell out. Guys, we are hosting a Sabaton today. Sabaton Sunday. It's the end of January 2021st. January has been a slow month. And we are hosting uh, a Sabaton. So if you want to support the stream and if you want to get like a long stream. 
That's what she said. <laughs> um, feel free to subscribe, gift subs, prime. Each new sub adds five minutes to the stream. Bits adds one minute. So, um, 100 bits, one minute. 500 bits, five minutes. And so on. Um, above my... There's a timer above my head, right here. And that timer will uh, get up and up. Wait, that doesn't doesn't sound right, man. It will get up and up. The timer will grow. The timer will... I think I need another coffee. We started early this today. We've been live already for like uh, three hours and a half. And we still have uh, at least four to go. Minimum four. Yummy. Yeah, it will increase. Yes, sir. Attack totem. Do we kill the totems? Yeah. What's the thingy? How about extended? Yes, the timer will get extended with each new sub. Extended, increased. Come on. I want to run on the mage as well. Uh, a BFD. Running out of mana. Help. Well, bye bye, bye bye mana. Let's hope we have enough to keep uh, the seal on. We have mana pots. <clears throat> Attack totem. Let's finish it. Finish him. Oh, the chest, boys. Twilight Avenger Chain. Let me check if Bilbo has it. 48. Let's go. I think Bilbo has it. No, he has the epic one. <clears throat> Let's go. Is that better than the Divine Storm one? More stamina? I think it is, right? What is a Crashing Thunder? Fist weapon. Main hand. I can't use that, no. This is a good chest, man. Dildo Baggins, that's his name? Dildos. Oh, it's like a Dildos, but Dildos. Have you gotten the Murloc bag? I have it on my Hunter, I think. On my Hunter, I have everything. Like, everything. Oh, wow. Big pull, boys. You guys ready? Oh, my God. What do we do here? Do we have some nades with us? I don't know. We can try. Get a little gnome here. Look at the mages. The mages should be popping. There are two mages. One heal. But even the heal should, um... Try to do it, like, quickly, uh... Yeah, we're not even doing damage compared to... The mage should be doing more, to be honest. Maybe he didn't have mana. Oh, wow, one is dead. Come on, mage. Why so dead? Okay, we got that one. No. Uh, I can't even use mana to... Okay, let's go loot. Hi. Hi. 
That was a big pull. Definitely. When did they introduce the boon? Uh, it was um, on the classic servers. I think it was with hardcore or something. Now we don't have any more uh, buffs on the people. So we're going back to... So what do we want is from the last boss, mostly. We want... Um... Let me equip this new chest, right? We lose 5 strength, but we gain... 6 agility. And 2 stamina, and 4 defense rating. I think it's better, man. And if we get like another piece, we're gonna get 12 attack power. So we need a helmet too. And another piece we get like, oh my god. Chrono Boon or the Boon of BFD? Well, this was added right now. The Boon of the Black Phantom. With, um, with Season of Discovery. But the Boon, the one that you used to save the buffs so you don't get dispelled, that was added a long time ago. Do I have to go rebuke? No, I think we have like two people who can interrupt there. What would I have to give for a rebuke? Exorcist? Uh, we have nine people. Let's go rebuke if I need to... I'm gonna go rebuke. <clears throat> Man, I can't get rid of this look. Oh, now I can. Okay, no more of that. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, that's it. Uh, should we get one foot buff? No, I think we're fine. Hey, let's you equip the chest with agility. And more stamina. <laughs> so far, we got two upgrades. We got this and this. Whoa, whoa. Wait, wait. Wait, 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 wait. Who dares disturb my meditation? Oh, shit. What was that in the chest? What room do we don't have? I wasn't ready. Fuck. Divine Storm, yeah. Oh shit. More time to focus on the rebuke. On, uh, yeah. Well. <clears throat> I can't do damage, boys. We lost, like, two, two, two major runes. Exorcist and also, um, which, which was on the... We equipped the new chest. 
Uh, do we... Whoa. Okay. Let's fap here. I mean, there's nothing wrong with that. So the slick fingerless gloves, leather ones with healing spells, twilight invoker robes, and uh, calorie satchel. <laughs> roll. The warlock goes like, roll, who wants it? <coughs> That's shit loot, isn't it? Okay, let's put the rune before we fuck up again. Divine. W when did he do it? Okay. Well, it was only white stuff. Nothing uh, was there. No food? No food at it. Oh. Twilight Invoker Robe. So let's see who gets that. That's huge, right? I think we have to change Rebuke as well. From the pants, we don't need to... Hey, the Warlock is the only one on the robe, look at that. Whenever I went to that, like, we were 10 people rolling. How do we apply? Oh, wait. What? Okay. Exorcist on the pants. Beautiful. Now the last boss gives us the the trinket, which is 18 attack power, which we don't know exactly if we should should take the spell power one or the attack power one. What do you guys think for the paladin? Because uh, my idea is that I would take the spell power one if there would be like a consecration farm in phase two. And people rolling for the robe is quite a feat. Yeah, you you get my point. Like there were a lot of people rolling for it. I, I, I lost the roll, so I had to purchase it for 30 gold. I think I overpaid. Dice! Dice with the tier 1 sub for 16 months. Adding 5 more minutes to our uh, today's stream. Each sub, guys, today adds 5 minutes to the timer. So it can go anywhere to 24, 48 hours. I saw a hunter get the epic two hand sword. <laughs> Don't think it's gonna be the case here though. Okay, let me drink. Use one food buff. And then I'm gonna pull. <clears throat> Yo! Deagle! Thank you very much for the prime gaming. Bilbo's. And do I have... Whoa, dude, what's going on? Can't hold aggro. Breath incoming. <laughs> you have Righteous Fury, I have. I want to hold aggro. Breath incoming.
Where's my mana? How do I get some mana back? Do I go here? No? I think I overused my mana. I couldn't hold aggro, man. I don't know, I, I, I thought paladins were stronger. I spammed as many spells as I could, man, but... How do I, I can't cancel my uh, Righteous Fury during combat. Did you notice that? So... <coughs> kind of weird for me. Breath incoming. No mana again. I think we're gonna be fine. Breath incoming. There we go, he's gonna die. Sword? Sword? Helmet? Ew. 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 Okay, we need the, the trinket boys. But which one do we choose? Which? You cannot turn twice, right? Let's see, do we have the roll with us? Haba! 84, let's go! Baby! Huge! Huge! Poor Bilbo's, man. Poor Bilbo's. Well, let's go! Okay, uh, which one do we get, guys? So we got a total of uh, one, two, Three items. But to tell you the truth, like... Four with the bracers. It is a... You're sealing too much. Seal Crusader on boss. Oh yeah, that's what I forgot. I forgot to put Seal of Crusader on the boss. So, um... I think we, we kind of make, made a mistake there. When is the reset? My rolls are insane. We got a lucky day today, yeah. But it wasn't always like this. Okay, so, um, which trinket do we get, guys? Do we get the attack power one or the spell power one? What if in phase two there's going to be a grind or a poly tank? AP? No need to turn in the quest now. The reward is a trinket, like um, either one with uh, 11 spell power, either one with uh, 18 attack power. You can only do the quest once, I think. Can you complete it twice? I don't think so. Only once. Fuck. That's a good argument to wait until phase two. But, um... Spell power is good for both specs. AP not. <laughs> yeah, but if red becomes really good in phase two... Some say you can complete it again. But trinkets are unique. Really? I don't think you can complete it again after you got it once. I don't think you can, though, yeah.
Anyway, I'll think about it. Not sure which one to choose yet. <coughs> you have to delete it. And you can complete again. Take the healing power. 20 healing man, that's uh, pretty good. Don't Paladin scale on several of their new spell runes with attack power? You can't complete the quest twice. I have tried on my main just yesterday. I'm sure Blizzard will help retribution and protection scale from their attack power. You know. You know what? I'm just gonna take the attack power. Fuck it. I, I wanna play the red right now. If there's gonna be a better trinket in phase 2. I don't even know how much 11 spell power gives to... Someone said if you delete a trinket, you're going to be able to do it again, the quest. But I, I still doubt it, though. Fuck it, let's do it. I'm gonna get the attack power one. No, you can't? <laughs> Seems like a meme, huh? You can restore it if you delete it, probably. Okay, let's let's do it. Let's 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 do it. Check if there's another group for my mage. <clears throat> Need uh, one DPS, then got to go. Um, hey, hey. Need a mage pumper? Login on Prostadamus. His name is Phil. Wait, they only need one DPS, so we can... Let's go, boys. Hey, uh, fresh run. Fresh run, right? Sweet. What spec do we have here? We have Arcane. Uh, country spec here, so let's just go. Where is everyone? Let me check where's my uh, Hearthstone. Darnassus. It's gonna take a while to get there. We don't have any buffs. Well, that's fine. We have in the bank the 5% damage one, right? Let's go get that one. Yep, we have this one in the bank. Also, we have one FAP. One FAP should be okay. Uh, nothing, uh... Okay. Okay, nothing hard reserve. Let's go. That's just good spec. Good. Let's go. Let's see if we have the luck. If we keep on going with the luck. We're on a streak, boys. I want to play fire, but where do I respect? Never mind. You can buff your mage with a boonie if you had in log out and yeah. Drop the buff frost. I am listening. Farewell. <laughs> no BFD buff 
Yeah, but if you're arcane, you don't need hit. You have like 6%. Plus, I have one from a uh, gear. So it shouldn't be a problem. Wow, we found a... Um... Varinius, how you doing, man? Happy Sunday. Happy Sunday to you. Happy Sunday to you, too. I don't have the boon. No boon. I can't mount. Hey, my mount is in the bank. Shit. Why do I put shit in the bank? Like, I put, like, look at that. I put quest items in the bank. I think I went to, to grind. Ephemeriel, welcome back, my friend. We had uh, the beginning of the stream like three reactions, but you know. Oh shit, loot master. No. We're screwed, boys. Yo, Baddy! Baddy with the Prime Gaming. Are you Baddy the, the, the druid that was in my previous group? It was a baddie in my previous group. Thank you very much for the Twitch Prime. Five more minutes to the stream. We have three hours and 39 minutes left. Insane. Thank you very much, baddie. Welcome back. Well, welcome to the stream. Pew the Rock with the Prime Gaming for two months. Welcome back. Three, three hours and 44 minutes. Can we get above four hours again, guys? Because we started the stream with four hours. A couple of hours ago. And we're still like um, three hours and 44 minutes. Hmm. Awesome. Let's go in. And I'm going to have to buff some people here. Let's see how it goes today. I'm going to get this 5% buff, because we don't have the boon. I'm going to get this cord here. What else we need? Oh, I don't have like... I don't even have faps with me. I don't have the wizard oil. Oh, shit. It's fine. Anything else we need to take from here? I think we are good, right? Yeah. A druid buff. We don't have a druid. Oh. How was the run, uh, Ephemeriel? Speaking of running, I think I should go on the treadmill soon as well. Okay. Ready. Pull in 10 seconds. Oh shit, wrong... No, 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 no! I have the wrong runes. Well, you know what? Let's spam Frostbolt. Is this immune to Frost? Oh my god, what am I doing, dude, with my life? Wrong runes. Am I doing 100 DPS with no runes? Not easy. Hide tight choker and shoulders. Probably the best loot from this. Ooh, this one would have been good on my paladin, man. Holy. 
It's shown with red, although I can equip it. It's shown that you know. Okay, let's see. So, uh... Okay. You did 60 minutes instead of 40. Very nice. Uh, no. I can blast, right? Uh. That guy name, uh, rogue name is Ahahahaha. Nice name. <clears throat> no mana pots no mana pots but we'll be fine um oh shit i'm the only caster on this fight whoopsie a uh, whoopsie Drinky, drinky. Okay, we're ready. Oh, two lesser mana potions. Thank you very much. Let's put them here. Thank you. One, two, three, four. Oh, shit. One, two, three. One, <coughs> two. Oh my god, what did I do, man? I lost my stacks. One, two, three. Look at the rogue pumping, man. How he's like doing poisons or what kind of damage he's doing there. It's not okay for a rogue to do that much damage. It's against the terms of service. So he's doing a um, saber with um, deadly poison and venom. He almost did more damage than I did. Oh, look, the bracers and shoulders. Not bad, not bad. You got the rank 1 uh, Arcane Mages on Oceanic servers. Ooh. Do you have any tricks to teach me? As a... Um... What kind of mage don't use Living Flame? I think I used it at the beginning, didn't I? And then at the end... Well... Wasn't worth it anymore.
Let's check this uh, Paladin. This Paladin is doing uh, good damage. I think he might have the Epic Sword. Because I can't explain it otherwise. Can't inspect him. Yep. He seems like he's a sword there. No, definitely. So it seems like Paladins with uh, Epic Sword might be useful. Boots, chain, he needs the helm too. So he makes a full set. Food oil? I forgot them in the bank, I think. I, it was the last spot. We just finished the running with the Paladin. And it was the last spot and I was like, uh, yeah, let's go. Twenty seconds. Uh ten sec. The mask and the gauntlets. You can see here if you guys want. The rolls. <clears throat> so what we need on this guy is the necklace from Kelris and the stuff from Kelris. Anything else if you guys know, let me know. But I think the necklace and the stuff... Arcane wand, maybe? I think that's it. Set headpiece. Um, do you think uh, why arcane over fire? Because I couldn't get to a, a trainer to respect. This is my grinding spec arcane outside in the world. Fire would have been better with this group because it has a lot of damage, and we would be able to kill like really, really fast. We're not really parsing. Maybe we should next phase. Try to get like 99s fully. Maybe a couple of world records. What do you guys think? Should we parse? I think we should parse next phase. We're gonna get a bunch of characters and... Uh... I think we're gonna try to put the name on the... Uh, extra stamina plus spell power, the set headpiece. 
Um, you get like... Well, it's not the extra spell power, because... Uh, Yeah, we'll see. The priest has it, right? So the priest has it, and um, the other one it's offline. I can swap if it's needed to to heal a bit. I can swap my runes. Was heal. Oh, this one has the stuff. Priest uh, was heal. I can swap a rune or two. I can uh, swap a rune. Why well, am I the only one who can use this, the the stuff in this rune if it drops? Because the priest already has it. Are you crazy? Oh my god! Hunters need it. It could be. You never know. A hunter with serpent sting damage. We use the regeneration, so we can actually help the heal a bit. Any BFD weapon oil? Never mind. Arcane seems to be more fun than fire. Yeah. Is all me this um, raid? Oh yeah, you're the hunter, right? Craig. Um... Craig, let's see. Not bad, not bad. You need some new shoulders, boy. New shoulders. Maybe the boots as well. My hunter is full beast, man. I should show you my hunter. Let you play. Stop it, man. What the fuck? I told that guy I could heal. Bullshit. 
Yo, League of Loki. Thank you very much for the raid. Welcome, welcome everyone. How was your stream, man? Yeah. Someone died. Let me give you a shout out here, but I'm in the middle of the fight. Exclamation shout. Did it work? Oh shit, I'm gonna die. Shit. I needed to heal this guy. <laughs> oh my god. What a mess. Almost dead. Let's see what the, what was the loot though. So. Oh wow. Ew. Ouch. Ugh. Ugh. That wasn't good. Um, should I use Master Gen instead of Living Flame? Nah, I think we're fine. We might use it for uh for calories though. Let's use because I never use Master Gen. I don't even know how to use it. How does it work, though? All party members, right? You heal. You click one party, okay. So I think I might need to heal the melee here. What's the item that shows you the loot in the middle of the screen? It's called uh, scrolling loot text. Scrolling loot text. Thank you for the shout, I think I'll jump into WoW again later today for a second stream. Sounds good, man. You probably want the mouse over macro. I think we'll be fine. Let's go. Oh, they're fighting here mobs. Now you'll get those healing parses. Yes, baby. Healing parses. Are you fucking kidding me? Attack totem.
Attack totem. Oh, silver hand sabatons. I don't I haven't seen those ones. They have a strength, agility, and stamina. Those are good. How is my healing? Let me check. Uh, Lorgus Jet. Healing done. Uh, Lorgus Jet, right? Hey, not bad. Not bad. Should we go uh, back to Living Flame? No? Good morning, the chemist. Good morning. So we did a... Priest did 8.8k healing, I did 6k. Almost as much as the priest, without even knowing... Uh, this was the first time using Master Generation Rune, by the way. I didn't even know exactly how it worked. But it works basically kind of like normal regeneration rune. It just lasts for less, at least. On the target. You just got the epic crossbow on your hunter. Whoa. On first hunter clear. I healed as mage in this regional abilities themselves are not that good solo, of course. Mm -hmm. I wonder if you start like a group with mages. So one mage... One mage would use master regen. No. I don't know. Now you're logging? Oh my god. No, my parses are not good. I'm healing. I'm hybrid. Ah, it's fine. I'm joking. I'm from Sadamos. No one needs to see my logs. Mastery Gen Group 1, AB. Mastery Gen Group 2, AB. Rinse and repeat. You can do two ABs if you want. I'm param param. I'm param param. Pam param para para. One AB so cheap. Uh huh. Uh huh. Hey, Jildum, how you doing, man? I need some coffee, guys. I need another coffee. Oh wow, if the staff drops now, you crazy? Because no one else needs it. If the staff drops here, I think I'm going to play on NA for the phase 2 launch for the first day. Gonna get this mage to 40 first, probably. My shoulders are red. What? Almost red. Yellow. So are we playing here with... Um... I'm not sure if we should use mass regen here or if we should keep leaving flame. I think I should focus on the tank. Uh, 
Uh, tough one. You guys have a new guy in the office? He's Romanian. He sounds and looks like you. Oh my god. You will find out which, uh, where he's from Romania, I assume. Fine, man. Plenty of Romanians everywhere. <laughs> okay, we're gonna keep uh, living flame. Not gonna... Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. Because we have kicks and we have everything. We have a fap. Any fap? I need a fap. Twenty-five. Five. I think it's four, twenty-five silver. Three, two, one. We should have used Arcane. Um... Yo, Kathy, with the Prime Gaming for the 10 months, the stuff will drop. May the Lord hear you, son. I'm consuming too much mana, man. Let's use the... Oh, no, don't use the pot. It's just that... Let's use one of this. Interrupt. Ooh. Oh no. Dust to dust. Uh, someone is going to die. I think I did well. Ah, uh, unfortunate guys, no stuff. We try to. There's a belt there and there's a helmet. None of them useful. I think the necklace here would have been good for us as well. So the necklace or the... No, guys, not like this. What have I done to deserve no stuff? At, le at least the neck. I don't even want the stuff because I have look good weapons. I have the tome with this one and this one. And the necklace would have been seven spell power and armor because that's important. No, well, it is what it is. We got anything this run? No! I don't think we actually need anything else. That's the weird thing. Uh, maybe the helmet from the set? Yeah. Yes, we can get this helmet from the set. Why is armor important? Uh, it's for face tanking, pretty much. There are some pools that do a lot of face tanking, especially in dungeons. 
So armor can help a bit, take less damage overall. So uh, asked a hundred times, how's the MS lag? Is it horrible? I'm playing with 133 right now. 133. I'm not sure if this... I think this is an uh, East Coast server, right? I'm playing on Crusader Strike. I think it's East Coast. Because normally on a uh, West Coast, I play with 170, 180. So it's worse. I think we're good. We had no BFD boon, guys. For this run. 133 is manageable. Hmm. How much gold do you have on the horde? I have 1.1k. One 1.1k. You know what's the weird stuff? I think I did like 7 or 8 uh, Wars and Gulch on my Hunter. And... Um, did, the, did the honor reset? What day is today? Today it's a Sunday. I need to check if the honor reset because... We needed like literally... 2 or 3 more wins for... Um, Wow. For rank 3. You play on Crusader Strike from Australia. And you still manage to parse 99 with 200 MS. Games like WoW are fine with a little latency. But maybe you parse 99 not because you're from Australia. Maybe you're smart. Have you ever thought about that? Five, four, and you possess some three. skills that... Okay, enough with Can I use rank 1 here? Uh, Breath incoming. Oh shit. Nah. That was the stupidest breath ever. Can I cleanse something here? What, what does happen if I go here? Breath incoming. Did you feel the raid? Wait, what? We're fighting last boss. Oh shit, the priest is back, the one that went offline. Oh no. He was away for a long time, man. Coming. My paladin is going to die. No. Breath and coming. Power went out. Nothing good dropped anyway. Well, leather chest. Yeah, nothing, nothing good dropped. Okay, not the best run, boys, but, well, what? You got my attention. Off with you.
Cheers, man. Good run. I got kind of carried there. Well, I kind of started healing. Because our priest um, lost power, unfortunately, for him. Let's quickly hop on the EU side a bit of things. And then we kind of come back here. We want to we wanna do more things on NA. We have a couple of options today to do. Either we roll, uh, we level a rogue, or we level a boomkin. Feel free to browse. Both of them seem to be like fun for phase two. Man, some of those should sell on the auction house. I don't know, sword of the tiger, belt of the tiger. Let's try to put them on the auction house. See what happens. Bright sphere, definitely. Farewell. Boom, it's insane. Yeah, wh where does it make more sense to level a boomy? On the Horde side or on the Alliance side? I already have a good name on the Horde side. Well, that's a good question, Horde or Alliance. Ah, ah, right sphere, right belt, 8 silver. Wow. Doesn't really matter. Well, night elves, night elves look better, don't they? What do I repair? Mm. I don't like that Nasus. I can help summon you to Star Surge, Run on Crusader Strike and A. But wait, we haven't said what we're gonna do first. There we go, we got the boon. Very nice. The Paladin was luckier today. We got a bunch of items. And we even got the rune. And I think we're gonna go for the attack power one. I'm not gonna regret not getting the spell power one. There we go. Sweet. Good, we have boons on both of them. Do -do -do. One, two, three, four. What items we got so far? Looks better than mine. Thank you. Coffee is gone. It's gone? Yeah. All of it? We have no coffees left, boys. Quick, Twitch Prime, we have to buy coffee. <laughs> Shit. Okay, let's see. What do we have here? EU. We're gonna log a bit on the Beast Hunter, guys. We have a Beast Hunter on EU. Like, literally, we have no reasons. Even the bag we have, uh, the epic bag from um, BFB. I want to check if this week I still have a chance to, to get rank 3 on him. What is PvP? H. So this week we have 137, 3,350. How much do we need, guys? 4,800 honor? 4,500, that's all we need? A 
Try to record this. Let's put the this one here. It's gonna be good for a video though. Whoa, 880 gold. Let's go. Sell more stuff. Let's sell more stuff. I like selling stuff. And I like getting something back. Ooh, some items uh, go uh, down in price. I think we took this for bandages, right? One thing that I regret is getting skinning. I think I'm gonna drop skinning and I'm gonna get herbalism on this fellow. So right now we have skinning, but I think it's time to drop it and get herbalism for phase two. You got to turn five turn ins with marks already. That's 700 uh, honor. You think we should turn those in? Yeah, and then we need like one more run or something. Let me check. Your white herbalism? Because currently I have skinning and uh, skinning and mining. And I think in phase two, early first week or something, it's going to be good money to have herbalism, probably. Let me check. So I would like to go to the battleground, join battle. Let me check how much honor we have here 3.3k, 1, 3.5k. Oh, we got a boon. Wow, three marks are 170. So should we turn them all in? You think investing into strangle kelp is smart for phase two? I think a lot of people did that already. So there's two things that can happen in phase two. They're going to be overflowed on the market and people won't use it that much. And then uh, people will panic and they will try to sell cheaper and cheaper. Or maybe the price is just going to go up. It's really hard to predict. Look, we have 4,000 honor. So there's no point in going above 4.5k, you say, for... Uh, how do we know how much we need exactly? Are you going to use urban mining at the same time? I do have a macro, which allows me to swap. And I already know the locations of most herbs. Oh, we have five druids, guys. We have five druids, two hunters, two priests. There's no way, even if there's a pre-made out there, we're going to destroy them. And we have a pre-made, boys. We have an alliance pre-made. They have rogue. There's a pre-made made out there but I think we can destroy them hey destroy do we have any food buff no we don't have we don't have enough shit Listen, I'm going to use a strong troll blood here. Let me make some bandages quickly. Rankin, Ranker Adon. So it's 4.5k. Okay, we need 500 honor. We have a pre-made, boys. This is gonna be, like, interesting. Let me try to exit the other game. Because it's eating too much resources for now. Okie dokie. There's a... Everyone is bubbled. So what do we have there? A priest.
the hunter uh, start getting our mage okay let's get the hunter i know it shouldn't get the hunter but i think we can destroy him no we can't Man, uh, penance, like too much. Yeah, uh, we lost one already. Okay, we got one of them. I'm out of mana. The fuck. Ah, we're getting destroyed, boys. Do we take the flag? We took the flag, though. One druid is, like, trying to... to go for the flag, but first we have to break their spirit. It's not how it works, you know? First you always break their spirit. And then you go for the flag. Thanks for the miss, motherfucker. Let's kill Proctor. No, the mage. He's out of mana. Where's the flag though? Where's the flag? Mm -mm. I don't have bread for my pet. Let's see if we can find the flag here. Oh, it's already like there. Never mind. Unfortunate we got premade's voice. It is what it is, but um, hey, we, we still have a chance, though. Never give up, you know? Jolene, Jolene. I'm gonna die. This is it. Man, those priest heals are like too powerful for this level. It is going to be the same at the uh, max level. Your cat is shitting in the bed? I don't think so. I'm 
know, but he's behaving weird. Masturbated? No, no, my... My cat is like, um... Uh... Can't... Oh, it's my pet. Don't have food for my pet. Can I trade the mage? Can't trade, he's not from the same server. Bread, please. What else does fish? We have to buy some fish. How many priests do they have? Let's kill this hunter. Don't deal right here. Very nice. I'm trying to get the priest though. Let's see if uh Wow. What's the speed from, though? He keeps on getting a speed. When he runs. Casting versus Hunter. Interesting. My god. Ah! So close. <laughs> I lost my buff. No! Did I get any honor here? We're not even getting like uh, any honor. We got about close to 100 though so far. So if you re now, there's a chance that we would get on the same pre-made. I don't want that to happen. Man, look, one, two, three priests. What, what can you do? When a primate has three priests spamming sp penance, there's no nothing you can do. <laughs> Get fucked. <laughs> Not quite nothing. We got the flag. <laughs> oh, how... How bad are they, man? I have I even made any frags here? I've made two frags. No! Listen, they're not doing that well themselves. They're just capping flags. 
Not even sure why I um, killed the flag carrier. It would just end it sooner, right? But uh, let them suffer. Let them suffer, you know. You're a pre-made. You have to be able to close like a pre-made. Yeah, there are three priests, man, grouped up. And a dead rogue right there. No! I got like a hamstring. I haven't even seen the gnome. I'm gonna kill him with my pet, man. This is crazy. No! Let's find first some um, some food for the pet. We are lacking food for the pet. Also, we might be able to buy some... Um... Hey, wait, let's see if we can get 4,500 by turning in those two working much. Do, we f do you think we get it? No, but I think we'll be close to... One. Ah, we still need one more game to, to, to go. It doesn't matter if it's a win or loss, right? You can get cheese at the inn. Would uh, the serpent eat cheese, though? And honor. Let's check if the serpent would eat cheese. Bread next to the auction house. Fish. Let me check. Pet. Diet. Fish, cheese, bread. So we're fine. Hell. Let me browse your goods. Some cheese. Which one is good? I think the dwarven mill is pretty good enough. Let's go. One, two, three. Goodbye. The serpent is not what it used to be anymore, anyway. So we need one more game to be able to get 4,500 uh, honor. We did it during the peak time, and I think we won like six out of seven games. Let me check. Do we have a pre-made? We can't yet check. We need to wait a bit. Apparently, they're making some change changes for next phase uh, when it comes to pre-mades. Rogue or Boomkin, guys? What should we level? Rogue or Boomkin? Let's make a poll. I forgot how um, to make a poll. Let me check here. Hey, we just reached 55,000 followers, guys. Holy. Like, three followers ago. Who was number 55,000? I think it was... Uh, Terencio Vlog. Terencio Vlog, my number 55,000 follower. Kaffee, thank you very much for the Twitch Prime. Holy shit, 30 minutes ago. Guys, we are hosting a subathon today. If uh, you want to make the stream go for... Uh, an extended period of time, each sub adds 5 minutes. Each bit, 100 bits, adds 1 minute. In the corner of the stream right there, you can see. And the timer is above my head, right here. When this goes off, we say bye-bye. Let's see if we have a pre-made. And then we're gonna make a poll. We have a living flame pre-made. Oh, shit, man. Okay, so... It, it seems like there are a lot of pre-made at this hours. During the peak time, there are less pre-made. Or I was lucky just dodging them, I would assume. Slash poll. Question. What class should I level? Um, one. Rogue. Two. Boomy. That's it?
Duration of the pull, one minute. Let's go, guys. There we go. The pull has started. Or is it? Six votes on the boomy already. Oh my god, ten votes on the boomy. <laughs> I guess we're playing a boomy, guys. It's not over yet. No, not boomy. Anything else? Apparently, it's kind of fun, though. You go and you get, like, Star Surge uh, rune at level 1. And you kind of, like, one-shot shit. Let's try to get that priest. pre made baby. Okay, boomy it is, boys. We already have one created, so it's gonna be easy. Let's get that paladin hole. Man, it's impossible to out DPS the priest heal. Priest recently went through a nerf, but they are broken, man. Like that penance, or I'm not even sure exactly what's healing for so much. And I'm not sure how this is going to be at level 40. That hunter overextended. Okay. Not good, not good. Shaman are more broken than priests right now healing? You think so? Star Surge's level 1 is OP. You're leveling... At 40 is going to be more OP, the Boomy, because he gets like 100% critical strike damage increase, right? And... Um, We're getting destroyed, boys, by pre-maids. We should have joined a pre-maid, but... I don't think it's that fun running a pre-maid. It gets boring quick. Because, uh, You just stomp on people, right? And then whenever you're faced versus a, a pre-maid, it's not fun either, because you're just getting stomped on. Can't wait to see what kind of changes they have, but there's... Apparently there's going to be some sort of matchmaking system. Hunter just chases me and nothing happens to him. Unless I manage to pull this guy. There we go. I think we can get this guy. He overextended. Bubblish? Bubblish. Stomp or be stomped? To stomp or not to stomp? That is the question. Would you rather be the hammer of the, or the nail? Uh, the old philosophical question. Would you rather be the hammer or the nail? I think I would be the hammer, guys. God damn it, man. Why? Why am I the hammer? Why can I, I cannot be like Jesus Christ to be the nail? Because it's hard. Being the, ha the hammer is the easy way. Being the nail is the hard way, right? Anyway, let's lose fast. Let me check if we got 4,500 honor. Oh no, we got zero honor. What? How am I supposed to do anything, man? 
Oh my god! We need to go again. The previous pre-made, uh, at least we got a couple of kills. Let's get this guy. Maybe we can get some honor. There we go. Can we kill anyone else? Let's kill this priest. Oh, come on. Alliance wins, and we got zero. Oh my god. Isn't world PvP better for honor? Yeah, but we need 25 honors. So, that's what I'm saying. We need 25. Who are trying to give me a kill? Yeah, I guess so. Blood it's really hard. Like, uh, you find some pre-mates which have such a good setup. Almost impossible to... To beat them. Being the hammer, it's hard because you do work the nail. The nail just gets worked. Hey, that's a different point of view, I guess. <laughs> Ever heard about the relationship microwave effect? Some guys heat up the girls, but don't get to taste and live for others. Hence the microwave effect. Oh, interesting. But yeah, I know what you mean. How many Wars and Gold Marks do you have? I, I turned in most of them, so I have one left. Can I turn one? Or do we need to have three? Yeah, you need to have three. So, uh, next, next... Mm, this one we gotta like 100% like get what we need. Thoughts on the Gold to Torn Farm? You think it's worth it? I think so. I think I think it's gonna be worth it. Gold one is at the herb, right? Let's see. Uh, gold. Hey, gold. Torn. The gold one, uh, classic. It's used in um, probably elixir of agility. Reagent for twelve. So some of them will be able to craft all the way until one hundred and fifty-five. Skill required. Next page, right? Until 225. So, oh, no arcane elixir? No! Man, we don't have any... Uh, like, we don't have any caster potions. What the fuck? So you're gonna be able to make elixir of agility? Elixir of fortitude with uh, steel bloom. Steel bloom is gonna be valuable, man. Greater agility later. Next phase. Um... Uh. Frost protection. Greater defense. Whoa. So there's what? One, two, three so far. Greater mana. <sighs> Greater mana. But cut guards, it's hard to, f to get. However, you can farm it if you want. The cut guard whisker. I know where to farm it. Lesser stone shield. Oil of immolation. A restorative pot. Oh my god. Yeah, I think gold tone is going to be kind of valuable. Definitely. Okay, let's see what we have here. Uh, we have Zuckerberg. Zuckergus. And we have La Tortura. Only a hunter. We have two warriors, two rogues. This seems like a, a loss, even if you don't have a pre-made. Uh, we do have a pre-made. So it seems like at this hour, you only have pre-mades. Can we get 25 uh, honor? Let's see. If we cannot get 25 honor, it's not going to be good. Any decent farm available right now that doesn't depend on auction house to make the bulk of money? Um, questing for gold? Pretty good.
get fucked, dude. Uh, my honor point is there. Let's grab it. Oh, I got my honor point. <laughs> He's in a pre-made. What a tard there. <laughs> Run, forest. Okay, we got my honor point, though. It's fine. I'm not gonna let them uh, that easy. I'm gonna go back here. 2500. We need one more kill. Join the flag room. I need to catch another one. I think I can catch him. I think I can catch him. Okay. Does it work? I think it might work. But the... Okay, we got honor. There's a priest as well. Do we get for the priest? Let's put a hunter mark there. Honor. It's all we want. There we go, boys. I'm not sure if I got enough, though. Honor. Oh, no. <gasps> we need eight more honor. Okay. Man, it's only your fault, dude. You took a break. Mid fight. How much we need? Hello, cattle. How are you doing? This looks like a fun experience. Yeah, that, that's why uh, a lot of people complain about the... Um, the Wars and Gulch. <laughs> they might be doing a change, though. Or you can just find a pre-made. And farm rep. Forever. Yeah, we're being farmed, guys. I'm not going to be able to make a tunnel. I need to uh, get a 1v1 here, somehow. There we go. I think we have a 1v1. Pretend that we're going to drink. Kind of sad that premades have been a problem for all the classic expansions. There's so many things they could have done, guys, for Season of Discovery, but they didn't have, like, the resources and the time to think about it. But he could have, could have added, like, a system like Rated Battlegrounds, for example, for classic. Um... Shit, I'm so dead. Can't get my 8 honor. Fuck, man. I'm gonna have to run one more. Let me try to get one kill, though. I don't want to run again. So the way to get one kill... Look, I my, my pet spa spawns with 1 HP, and then he dies. <laughs> Beautiful. Okay. Come on, stay there. We 
into catch one. One, come on! Why? We need three more honor. Three more honor, boys. That's what we need. Let's go. We're gonna make it. Did we get it? Let's go! 4,500 honor. Ah. <laughs> uh. Rank three, boys. We're gonna get the cloak next week. And we gotta get the cloak at level 40 as well. No, is it? I think there's gonna be a new cloak, probably. I would assume, though. Okay, I don't care anymore. Let's just, uh... I could even AFK out of this. But we're getting one extra mark, so... Let's keep it. Why was the pet summon and uh, rest nerfed? I don't understand, either. Like... Um... I think they were trying to nerf hunters in general. In Warson Gulch, because whenever the Serpent was OP, maybe they applied a couple of changes, but maybe this is the way the, the Hunter Pet used to work. Who knows? Alliance wins. Okay. Finally. Now, guys, we are about to create the one and only. Actually, it's already created. A Frostadamus! <laughs> How do we get to Star Surge? Why do you put two points into Star Surge into one spec instead of Elemental Precision for f or Frost Warding? Um, I don't know to be honest. Come NA and I summon you to Star Surge. I'm gonna level the rogue on an NA. Human rogue. Here I'm gonna get my uh, feral. Let's get this one on um, EU. Let me think. The problem with NA is that I don't really play at the NA hours right now. So uh, I'm playing off hours. It's harder to find groups. What's wrong with my hair? The two hair. That's fine. Make EU rogue. No, I already made that character. Let's go, boys. Frostadamus. Get the, let's see if we can get a star surge rune. Once a nomadic people, the Torin roamed the endless plains. He had a balanced druid in the raid and he did 45 DPS on calories. And then we forced him to go wild strikes. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> oh, this is not looking good, boys. Okay, let me go a bit. Doesn't look good. You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna do an exit game here. And uh, we're going to go into summer around here. So we're gonna go into local disk C. Program Files 86, World of Warcraft, Classic Era, WTF, Account, which account is this with the Crusader Strike? We're going to delete Frostadamus, and we're going to copy Frostadamus, paste, and we're going to rename it with to Frostadamus. Ha! Frostadamus. Let's see if it works now. 
Can you server transfer in SOD? Mm. I don't know, to be honest. Mail. Ew. Not mail. He finally made a druid. Finally made a druid, my friend. Options, action bars, one, two. Okay. Now, what else can you teach me, guys, about here? About this druid? <laughs> I think I need, I, I think I know what I need to do here. Well, first of all, create a new window. You should have had this one. Settings. Accept the hunt begins. What brings you here? What brings you here, friend? Let me check if we can find a, a summon, though. What can we get summoned now? Because we have the uh, settings, global channels. Looking for group. Let's see. Greetings. We need to see if um, can we get the summons here. We can't see the summons here, right? Miscellaneous. Uh, looking for Thunderbluff summons. I think no one is summoning there. How are we going to get the... Rune? Yeah, but how do I get there? Thunderbluff? Let me check. Slash who... Um, slash who wetlands. Wetlands, Warlock. So we have a bunch of uh, Warlocks there. For Tuber 2. Time to walk. Zone. Summoner. 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 We don't have any gold though. Uh, yes, uh, but uh, we'll uh, mail the gold after. Okay. Oh my god, guys. Oh, where are we going? Limit. Oh my god, what are they doing there? Shit, how do we get there? How much he wanted? Two, three corpse runs? Sounds reasonable, isn't it? Two, three corpse runs sounds reasonable. Reasonable for uh, what we get out of it. Beautiful. Okay, what do we need to kill? Plain strider meat and feather. I 
can't. Oh my god, this is so bad. Look at that. What he, what is his name? Bror Brortal. Thanks, man. Let me log and send send you now. Oh shit, are those going to attack me? The quest NPCs are going to attack me? Brothel, okay, let's run there. Most likely. But they're in combat with other people, right? <laughs> no. Okay, we're good. Oh my god, we're not gonna make it there, guys. <laughs> Anyone in Wetlands or Crusader Strike NA? That's right. Whatcha... Whatcha guys doing here? Man, that's a big... That's a big raid. Options. A game. Combat. Floating combat text. Show healing. Uh, interface, we can get um, this one. Thank you, stuff. Can we run from that ooze? Oh my god. Ah, run! Oh. Uh. It's relatively close, yeah. Touching dwarves. How many times do you think we gotta die before we get it? Yo, Batali, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the stream. Five, six times. Man, I have to s s send that warlock uh, the gold. Brortal. Need to remember that. If someone is farming, you're not gonna die that often. Yeah. Three times in total. The, the the secret is to keep on moving. Look at this! Wow, we're on a roll, boys. I think we oh, we made like ten yards at least. Twenty yards, thirty yards. Oh my god, someone just killed the raptors. Run, forest, run! Do not eat the mushrooms until you are in the lake. Roger that. It was easier with the world buff. For the speed. Then he died to one of the stealthed mobs. Hey, what stealthed mobs? Ah, uh, it's next one, right? Lucky, lucky, lucky. Oh, the creepers. Jeepers. Creepers. Oh, we're so dead here. Are we, though? No, I think we're fine. Wow. There's one there. No, I saw. Someone else is trying. There's a mushroom around here somewhere. Okay, okay. Star Surge run. Yeah, we're level one. You like, my attention. sounds intriguing. We got the mushroom, right? That's what we need here. Let's put it on the top. 
Now let's try to head towards uh, the lake. Kill the ads with what? I can't. Ah, shit. We need someone to kill this one. Hey, look, there's a warlock there. Wait, those are not... Those that can kill me, man. Should run towards the lake. Which one is the lake? This one, right? Yeah, fuck. Shit. Should have run towards. Now we have to do at least two more runs. <laughs> it's gonna be totally worth it, guys. By the way, if you just popped on the stream today, we're having the Sunday Sabaton. It's the end of January, and we're trying to see how long this stream can run for. Each sub you do, each gifted, each Twitch Prime will increase the length of this, the stream by 5 minutes. So you can see the timer here. We still have 2 hours and 15 minutes left. So if you want to make a contribution and um, extend the timer, feel free to do it. 5 mana cost for instant 200 DPS. Very worth. Yeah, I, 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 I've, I've seen clips about it. Haven't tried it yet. I tried to do it on the hardcore challenge, but I died twice. So I took the droid from Thunderbluff. I walked all the way until um, Undercity. From Undercity, I jumped from the boat. I swam across the shore twice. And all the way until here. And I died um, here, basically, where I died now. And then I kind of gave up. Because I wasn't really willing to... I've been playing a lot of hardcore guys. I leveled 6 characters to 60. I think 6, maybe even more, who knows. There are people dueling here. Can we wait? I mean, if we get it now, we're gonna die. There's a level 10 who just managed to do it. Wait. Oh, I think we might be able to... One, two, three, four. Okay. So we are good. Whoa, that aggro range, man. That's not even fair. One more time, then. Let's see. We only have one mushroom. Eat it at your own risk. Well, that's what we're going to do exactly. Yo, Crashy Bernie. MIT. Crashy with the Prime Gaming. Five more minutes. Let's go, baby. Da -da -da. Not even she. Wow. Is this going to be the longest or the shortest um, sabaton ever? I guess we'll wait and see. Hello, Crashy Bernie. Welcome to the stream. We're about to get the Star Surge rune. This is going to be exciting. We have to send some gold to this character. If we want to pump, like, we have to buy some gear. Imagine getting 1 to 25 in one, one sitting. That would be crazy. Zapire 420 with a tier 1 sub. Thank you very much. And huge, guys. Today we reached 55,000 followers. Damn, man. I've been on Twitch for about seven years now. Seven years. Or we're gonna have... Maybe more than seven years. Okay, that one is too close. So I don't know exactly what to do here. Because if I eat the mushroom, I'm gonna aggro that one. 
Also, I need to leave the party. Maybe it doesn't work in raid or something. So, what do we have to do? We eat it and then what? This is not good. Kangar, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome. Eat and talk to the, talk to the frog. That's... It's very fast. So, we can do it before. Let, let's wait this one to run away. Cross there. This one is quite far away. This one it's here is like kind of question. Oh, this one patrols. Okay. Let's go, baby! Yes! Ha! But where do we put this one? A new engraving. Let me check. Engraved pants. We can put it on the pants right now. Okay, before we start, I'm gonna go pay the warlock. And I'm gonna send some money to this character. Oh, dear lord. Prepare, boys. Prepare for... Wow, it's... It doesn't even cost any mana? It says... It just says instant. And to the lock. Do you guys remember the name of the lock? Something with bro... Brortal. Yeah, that's the one. How much are we sending? One gold should be okay, right? For a summon. We do have like three... 1,200 mobs. Uh, gold in total. So... Send mail to... Bror... Pal. Um... Gold. For summon. Uh, how do you... Uh, payback. Payback. For summon. Imagine if we get banned for sending one gold to a guy. Hello. Hello. What the fuck, man? Hello. This is um, the payment for the wetlands summon. I was uh, pro... pro... Prostadamus, the druid. Thank uh, you very much. Let's keep it simple. May the wind always be at at your back. And the sun shine warm upon your face. May the winds of destiny carry you aloft to dance with the stars. Ah, oh, shit. May your wishes not come true. Wait. Okay. Stay frosty. One gold. Okay, to Frostadamus. My... My man. My man. <coughs> Hello, Alt. Hello, dear Alt. Today, I'm acting retarded. So here is some something little for yourself. Buy yourself something nice. Nice. And remember to make me a sandwich. Cheers. How much we send though? I think uh, 15 gold should be enough. Split personality confirmed. Send that cow some bags. You think we should send bags too? Why is mail not instant, guys? It's 2020 something. Uh, silk backpack. 
silk bag silk what silken ba what <laughs> sorry container small silk bag you guys small silk bag 50 silver look at that man a murloc skin bag let's send one of those too it's unique right yeah one murloc skin bag one small silk pack one large green sack and one large red one of each hopefully we bought one of each anything else we need to send to the druid though Maybe some gear. If first we have to, a guild and sword. Yeah, I'm playing on quota right now. I'm on quota. Quota 2. Maybe I should go on one. I'm not sure which one is bigger. Um, Let's look for a filter builder. Rever range between 6 and 12. 10? 20. Armor, all cloth, all chest. Let's see. We don't need to spend a lot of uh, owl. What kind of gear do we need? I think we need something of the... <gasps> Wait, we need spell power on the druid, don't we? But what kind of spell power do we need? It's really hard to say. Eagle set is fine. Arcane rat. Okay, let's just send some shit loot. We're gonna buy some more later. Chest, a waist. That's it, all the... This is all the cloth we have on the auction house? Oh my god, dead server, boys. Oh dear lord. Crusader strike, dead server. Look, native fans of the eagle, that's pretty good. For four silver. Uh, filter builder legs, uh, feet. Willow boots of the eagle. I look at that. Easy to stamina to intellect. And then we need a uh, wrist search. Uh, that's all the wrist. Okay, this is dead server, guys. Maybe we shouldn't play here. What's going on? Okay, that's enough. Let's just, uh, I don't know what else to buy. I think it, it, there's uh, the thing that uh, people don't play that much anymore, guys. So. People just don't play that much the game anymore until phase two is launched. They might be doing some other shit, you know. It's not like rocket science. We sent the gold already. I think that's about it. We could have sent some potions, but I think we're fine. Okay. Let me check if we have an ID for... Uh, we do have an ID for BFD, so... Buy a stuff. I forgot about the stuff. We're gonna get to, to Thunder Bluff, though. Let's see. Um... Uh... Let's start with the quests. Turn in a humble task. Let's see, is it one shot like people say? That's what people say. Oh, we don't have to move, it's channeled. I don't even know how to use it. You need the boon to one shot. Oh, well, we're getting scammed here, boys. Level up! I think the damage will increase now. Let me check. 
It previously was 45, now it is 44 still. Ooh, one shot. We got it. Look, it's working. Like, we're one shotting. Like, we're literally one shotting. And, uh,. We're gonna go for a boon soon. Yeah, okay, what's next? Water pitcher. You can just keep running and use it. I think that would be a good idea. I think we have to get um if we get a summon to thunder bluff we not we won't be able to come back here again so we didn't play it um properly hmm or well, we can do the starting zone and then we can get the boon I think that's gonna be good we need to get the other runes as well. I think we can get here Star Surge and a couple of other things. Not Star Surge, uh, Rat Rune. Peace, friend. Nomadic Belt. Be careful. Farewell. Ancestors watch over. Okay. Greetings, traveler. Relics of the Torrent. We get this one. Mark of the Wild, we get this one. Vendor Trash. Ooh. Greetings, traveler. Greetings, traveler. What brings you? Speed it up, boys. Speed it up. Greetings. We could go to... to Thunder Bluff, get a summon there. Then walk back here. With a booth. Nah. Not worth it. Where's the rogue? We made a poll between a rogue and a druid. I think we have to change the stream title, right? And it came out that uh, people want to see a druid rather than a rogue. So we're going to level the druid, but we're also going to level a rogue. So leveling druid. There we go. Awesome. Level up. Let's see the new... It's still kind of strong, though. Have to admit. Can't wait to get the boon. Oh shit, Sonia told me to come see something. And I, I forgot. Go back one second. <clears throat>
Oh, sorry, guys. <laughs> we need the buff. So much DPS and movement. Yeah, we gotta get to level 6 quickly, and then we're gonna move outside with the buff. We got, like, a, a pair of pasta. Let me show it to you here. So, uh, rated. This is, uh, tagliatelles con uh, chicken breast, con pancetta, and con pesto. So we have pesto, chicken breast, pancetta, and, uh, check it. Mmm. Oh my god. Oh, it's so fresh. Jesus. This is better than restaurant food, by the way. The quality. We have fresh chicken breast with fresh pancetta. The pesto is really good, man. Wow. And they're really, like, creamy. They're not, like, dry or anything. Look at this. This is restaurant quality pasta. But we do know how to make pasta. Like, I'm not saying I'm an expert on making pasta, but I've made so many pasta dishes. Like, I could say that probably during the course of my life, I made like carbonara pasta hundreds of times. And um, that's only that type of pasta. Because I made other types of pasta as well. So the more you do one recipe, the more you learn about it. How to make it better each time. You make mistakes in the beginning. First time it's going to be too dry. Second time you're going to overcook the egg. Third time you're going to be like, hmm, okay, this is the type of cheese that works good. Fourth time you're going to be like, hmm, if I mix a bit of parmigiano with the pecorino. You know? And... Uh, Every time you cook, time you cook again, you you make it better. How do you make your carbonara? Well, I um, I choose spaghetti. Sometimes I choose even like the the number five spaghetti, right? Because you can go with number nine, but anywhere from one to nine, it doesn't matter. Spaghetti it has to be all the time because carbonara already contains egg. You don't use like tagliatelle or something else. Always spaghetti. Or spaghettoni, if you want. Oh, you boil them. Uh, you fry the pancetta. Normally, you would have to use guanciale. Because guanciale has more flavor and more fat. But the high-quality pancetta is good enough. It's going to release a lot of flavor. So if you can find a really high-quality pancetta, it's going to be good enough. You fry it. And then you mix, like, uh, pecorino with uh, parmigiano, 50-50. And make with um, egg yolk and with a whole egg. It depends how much you make. Like, I make 100 grams of pasta. I put one entire egg and one egg yolk. I mix the parmigiano with the egg yolk. And I fry the pancetta. And then I add pasta water to make, like, a thick sauce. I put the, the pasta with the pancetta. I let it boil a bit. And then at the end, I put the egg. And um, mix it until it becomes, like... A creamy sauce, but you don't want to overcook the, the egg. Here we go again. <laughs> so basically, it's like really hard to explain. And you have to use like a lot of pepper, because that's why it's called carbonara. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. right? It's really good. I think the pan pancetta helps too. The chicken? Uh, no, it's not fast. Slow cooked. It's, uh, yeah. yeah, it's some of the juices from the chicken remain in the pan. And the most important thing, mm -hmm. the tagliatelle was boiled. You boil the pasta and the sauce for two minutes. Nice. The, the secret of making good food, guys, it's to use less ingredients rather than more. And you spend more money on high-quality ingredients, you actually go to the market and taste them. If you pick, like, some tomatoes, you want to taste them. Oh, if they have, like, rich flavor. And then, once you identify the high-quality products, you just use less of them. Cacio e pepe is another good example. Cacio e pepe is just, like, uh, 
Um, it's just like a carbonara, but it's different in which way? It doesn't have a... Pancetta, I think, right? It doesn't have meat. Uh, grind. Okay. Sorry, I forgot to grind here. I was getting distracted. No eggs? Oh, so that means you make it only with the wa pasta water? And with, um... Okay. Man, what's, what am I doing? Grind plane striders until you have two silver worth of uh, vendoring items. Oh my god. Oh, backpack. Let's go. Red backpack. Lots of pepper and water. Mm -hmm. Watch the fire temperature. Slow cook means more flavor. It's not always the case, though. Like, if you if you do some Asian cooking, like some of this wok-style cooking, like, they use a lot of uh, violence and aggressiveness in their cooking. They have, like, a very high heat over a wok, and then they, like, cook with speed, and their food has, like, more flavor. Like some some of that fried, and um, it's a different style of cooking, but it's rich with flavor. So they're different styles, yeah. I like to cook over high heat because I can cook my meals uh, much uh, faster. Definitely, the there are some foods that you have to slowly cook them. True. Gutter oil. Oh Jesus Christ! Level up. Hey, this is quite fast. Look, we're level 4. We just, um... No mana breaks. I think I sold even items that I could have uh, used as an upgrade. But I don't mind. We have two silvers. We have to accept a quest here. What brings you, you didn't hear, hear of this? Wins. No, I didn't hear of that. In Asia, they use gutter oil? I don't know, man. Moonfire and Rejuvenation. We got two new spells. Moonfire. And let's see Rejuvenation. Yay. Where do we put Rejuvenation? Let's put it here. And then we have Mark of the Wild. Crazy. There's no stats. It's only armor. Battle board and Battle Flank. We just go straight this way. And while we're going this way, let's just uh, have some pasta. Hmm. Woodhead is much better. You get aromas. You never had cooking so hot. Okay. Yeah, definitely, man. I really like food a lot. That's why I, I find it hard to stick with one diet. For example, keto. I like the carbs, man. And it, although I can do it a couple of, I can do it for a couple of months. Not eat that or not eat meat, or. It's just that uh, I like like every type of cuisine. I, I'm not yet familiar with the African one, and I find the African cuisine a bit... ...having too much aroma. But I, I, I would like to eat something from every country. Every country has some crazy dishes, that you must try them at least once in your lifetime. And some of them are not even that hard to make. Like, um... Basically, I know how to do a dish from almost every country. Have you tried Swedish meatballs? I went to Ikea. They opened in my city an Ikea recently. So we went there and we had the Swedish meatballs. Let's just say I'm pretty sure Swedes have like better things in their country. Rather than the Swedish... Maybe the Ikea ones are not the good ones. <laughs> but I know how to cook a, like a dish from almost every country. I know how to cook like, uh, Italian dishes, multiple Italian dishes. I know how to cook like uh, French dishes, I know how to cook like Romanian dishes, broad stews, Hungarian. I know how to cook Chinese dishes. Or Asian, very uh, stir fries and stuff like that. 
So I take one recipe and I kind of repeat it like multiple, multiple times until I can uh, get it better every time. Like lately, last year, I think I ate like 10 times in two months, like beef bourguignon. I was trying to see like, how can I make it faster, better, you know, like stuff like that. Anything from Portuguese. I went to Palma de Mallorca last year and I ate a paella. And I kind of liked it. So I think Portuguese is like some sort of... It's like a Spanish Portuguese dish, but... There's also like a, the... There's, there's another dish that I want to eat and I think it's Portuguese as well or Spanish. With the oxtail, right? Paella is Spanish, not Portuguese. Isn't it like both, to be honest? I think both of them might have it. Come to Portugal for one year. I'll cook you a different cod fish every day, every single day. Wow, you have so many guys. Jesus Christ. Yeah, the, the cuisine culture, it's like so rich. Like Greece has different things. Like in Greece, you find like so many things that you never find in other places. And they have like those simple dishes. They have like a dessert called Portocalo Pita. Which is as simple as it is like, but it's so good. The, the best recipes are the ones that are simple at their core. It's not going to be something complicated. Just a couple of high quality ingredients from local ingredients, obviously. Because ingredients taste different in every country. Beef tastes different in uh, USA. Beef tastes different in Argentina. Argentina probably has the best beef at all, all the place. And beef tastes different in Romania. It, it's about what they eat. It's about the species of beef that they have and uh, the way they cook it. And many, many other things. But it's it's to, uh, like, thyme, for example, or, uh, or parsley. It tastes different from Greece than it does from, let's say, Romania or from France. Because there's a different climate. There's a different um, soil. And you wouldn't even recognize it. You would be like, hmm, what is this? Is this like thyme? That doesn't taste like thyme. Japan has the best beef. Oh, you're talking about Kobe? Or uh, which which one has uh, Japan? Not Kobe beef. It's, uh, yeah. I never taste that. Um, there are some uh, like really wa Wagyu. Yeah, Wagyu. But that's kind of expensive. I haven't had yet any Wagyu. I heard it's really good and juicy and tasty and packed with flavor, but... Frost, what did you have in the chicken pasta again? It's very simple. Chicken breast. Tagliatelle pasta. If you can make them home, it's better. If not, just buy some fresh ones. Um, so... Chicken, tagliatelle, and pesto. A very high quality pesto. I would recommend making it home. So pesto is made out of olive oil, pine nuts, uh, basil, um, Parmigiano. But there there are not days like high quality pesto sold in uh, markets or even supermarkets. I have one from Barilla. I did not make it myself because sometimes I do, but not all the time. And Sonia put also pancetta today. So it's pancetta, but only for a bit of flavor. Pancetta, chicken breast. Oh my God, I have to eat this. Okay, it's going to get dry. I have some old processed food only. Can we not talk about the amazing cuisine? Listen, eat that old processed food and think that you're eating something else. <laughs> Imagine that you're eating like whatever you want. And keep in mind, if you learn about cooking in real life, you don't even have to be an expert. You're going to be able to make yourself very flavorful food with little money and little ingredients. Like if I want right now, I go in my kitchen and I make a pasta like alioli, pepperoncino, which requires like literally whatever you have in the house. And you can make it anytime you want. And it's 
Like, if you know how to do it, it's gonna be so good and so fast to make. Also, like, egg dishes and stuff like that. It's a Sunday. Sunday, usually, you make, like, uh, eggs benedict. I have a nice way to make a hollandaise sauce. Like, uh, it's a really fast way. You need a submersive blender. The free rat rune is this... It, yeah, I think uh, Lunar Idol is this the one. I actually think that there are two runes here. We have to find a second one. Okay, let's go this way. Because we have to climb uh, somewhere. Where is it? Yeah, this way. No, it's this way. I have a passion for food, for fuck's sake. Um, yeah. Before being a streamer, I used to have a coffee shop. It was more like a deli place than a coffee shop. So I was doing like service for the morning breakfast and I was making like a lot of sandwiches and stuff like that. Hot soups and so on. But prior to that, I worked in two major kitchens. And, um... I do like food, man. Although I'm skinny and I, it doesn't look like so. Because uh, I don't eat much. I just like eating high quality and less. But I like uh, food. It was uh, before the bubbles. We started the bubbles after we got kicked from the coffee shop. Because we didn't sign like a contract. And we lost the business. We were young and we were like... Made a, a verbal deal with someone. And listen guys. If if you like... Ever like... Get an, in, into an arrangement with someone. Just sign something. Sign something. Look for uh, some legal matters. Or else you might get a uh, little fuck. Hey, Wasabi, I haven't seen that. What is that? I think there's another rune here, isn't it? Uh, inside here, or there's a quest inside there or something? Hungarian bacon fry. Mmm. Level up, boys. Level 5. And we got the Fury of Storm Rage. For Oh, what do you... Chest. We need a pair of gloves. Do we have any? In the bag? There we go. There's a pair of gloves, gloves here. Let's try to... Um... We literally don't need any mana for the druid right now. Travel to the cave. Use it to start the quest. Okay. Let me know if there's a another thing you can get here. Because this is kind of crazy, like... Hit it, man.
I'll definitely check it out. I do sometimes travel to Hungary. Is this the rune? I wonder. Uh, let me check. It does start the quest. Attack on the camp. No, it's it's not the one. Relics for the Tauren. Engraved chest, Fury of the Stormage. We have that one. So which rune do we get here? I think this, this is the only one, right? We have to check again. Tell you the truth, I still feel like a rogue um, would be better. Let's get frosty to three hours. Nice long stream today. You'll start it off. Holy shit. Let's go. We're back to two hours, boys. Two hours left on the stream. Craze, thank you very much for the... Gifted subs, let's go, guys. Let's try to figure out how I get out of here now. Let's go two hours left on today's stream. So at least we're gonna do it... Um, for two more hours. No matter how many spells they give to the druid, it seems like rogue is more fun, to be honest. <laughs> Let's grind to 880, because I think we can get level 6. And if we can get level 6, we can go to Thunderbluff and get... Um, the boon. People say the boon is better. It's gonna be faster. It's gonna be more uh, damage to the star surge. Rogue was fun too. The rogue runes are kind of garbage for leveling. Saber slash. Or do you get that late? There we go. Heart, heart to camp. Um, nah. Cool down. Let's walk there. You think the rogue runes were kind of garbage for leveling? Okay. The mage ones are the best ones, aren't they? The quick draw. Hmm. <clears throat> Saber slash early. 
We gotta go do a good weapon. The disadvantage to casters in classic comes from um, well warriors and rogues being able to get plus weapon damage right to most of their spells. Sinister strike, overpower, especially some of the new things, it's plus weapon damage. So um go in peace. You wish to speak? It ends up like, well, rogues getting two types of upgrades. They get the spell, and then from the weapon, they also improve the damage. While the casters, the weapon doesn't really improve your damage in any way. If you get like the stuff from dead mines, you get like eight intellect. Only one that would improve your damage is right now the stuff from BFD, which has 26 spell power. But even that, it's not even, like, it's gonna be a huge difference. Like, for example, if you get the epic sword on a warrior, and you go from, like, a shitty sword, and you get the epic staff on a mage, the improvement is gonna be way higher on the warrior or the rogue with the one-hander than it would be on a mage or any caster. Level up, level 6. Voila! Train Roth. Train Torns. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, I seek further training, uh, Master Druid. Uh, let's see. Torns, yes. And uh, Wrath rank 2. Okay, okay. Is there any other rune in the starting zone? I don't think so, right? Let me try to see here. Um, rune guide, chest. 8 Mulgore, Living Seed, that's uh, later. Okay. We have uh, Mangle and Sunfire. There is a Sunfire. Where is it? It's up here. I remember that one, okay. Um, Rune Guide, Legs, Life Bloom. Okay, nothing in the starting zone, I see. Okay. The one in the mine. I don't know which one. I, I went and got one from here. What's up, maybe Torquil? I've been trying to finish this pasta dish for a, a moment now. Questy can show you the place. Yeah, it shows you here. And I think, look, we have it in the... Um, I was just impatient. But we have it in the guide. Be careful. We have it here. We go first get the... The Sunfire. Looking good.
you need a long ass chain for quest for rogue. Um, what is this one? One, two. The Paladin had like a long chain. Uh... Hey, do I need to be closer to them? Seems like. Ah, it has to be fast. Chads don't heal. <laughs> hey, Bezarus. Hello. Credito, thank you for the follow. Welcome to stream, guys. Okay, okay I have a couple of more bites here. I am well fed. Now we can focus on leveling this druid. We have to get a boon buff. We get a summon to... Slash played. We have 57 minutes. Where is a happy face if you're well fed? I don't really level uh, Torrents, so leveling in the, the Torrent starting zone is kind of... What feels kind of new to me. Oh my god. Look at the map. Ouch. It's good, it's good density. Yeah, it feels like everything you kill here kind of uh, helps you, or serves a purpose. Walk with the Earth, Walk with the earth Mother. How may I they really have to do something about the mail. Takes too much time for the mailbox to arrive. My bags are there, friends. Well, we can. Okay. Vendor the trash. Sell your weapon. Ah, 
and buy a walking stick. Wait, what? You want me to do that? I don't think I can afford. Well, this is without the runes. This is the old school way. I don't think you need it anymore. Yeah, the mail between the alts. I don't care if I send to someone else. Maybe that can take like more, right? It needs to verify if the gold is not bought or whatever. Be careful. Po -po 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 -po. What quest we have there? Poison water. What is the other quest? Ah, uh, found it. Poison water. Greetings, traveler. Traveler. I greet you. The funny part about druid is that when you get geared, you can get both cloth and leather items. Oh. <laughs> Some mages won't like that. But it is what it is, guys. It is what it is. <laughs> they sent me south for some reason. But I want to go uh, Thunder Bluff. Oh, let me try to buy a salmon, but is there anyone dropping at this hour? Like, uh, let me check based on how many BFDs are there. I think people are dropping the buff. Uh, let's just keep on farming and then uh, we're going to go there eventually. We do have seven minutes on this one. I think we can Hearthstone back. Let's see if we can find a summon to Thunder Bluff. This server doesn't have a dedicated uh, summoner. Nah, it's just better to cast a rat, to be honest. I think people made the druid to seem more than it actually is. They said you can one-shot mobs all the way until level 12. Uh, it's not quite like that. I wonder if we should pick this quest, the Ravaged Caravan. We have to pick it later. Hmm. Yeah, I have to pick it later. I'm gonna go grab it now. The boon gives flat 25 spell power. I think that's going to make a huge difference, definitely. Peace, friend. Go in peace. I was watching you, then I fell asleep on the couch. Well, you did go for um, a one-hour run, right? If you also ate something, that can give you a really nice crush. The body needs some sort of recovery. A prairie flower. What do we do with this one? Doesn't seem like we need it. It's probably for another class. Nothing special. Okay. Like I said, I'm not leveling too much um, on the undead. I mean, on the Torin. I don't play Torins. Um, only Druids, I guess. You don't really have other options. I think they're good for Warriors. Especially in Classic, like... Tanks.
The boon also gives hit. It helps too. I think Moonfire is kind of a waste to use because Moonfire costs 25 mana, does less damage, and Sunfire does way more damage. Is Moonfire now a meme or only at this level? You still keep the Moonfire dot up. I guess an extra dot. They instantly die. Just wait until I get the, the world buff. In theory, when I get the world buff, it's going to be like... Really, really good. So we do one of this. Let's keep it like it was. You guys see a summoner to Thunderbird? I haven't seen one. There's no summoners. Dead server. Dead server. Hey. This is Crusader Strike EU. I also play on the NA one. NA it's like really popular. But it's not bad. This one is not bad either. I'm pumping, boys. We need to find that cougar femur. Femur. Your home server is Chaos Bolt NA. Feels uh, a lot like Troublous NA. Back to 2019. Sometimes I feel like I want to play on those massive servers, but then I realize there's no need for the massive server. Everything is just fine. Thunderbuff summon. Uh, can uh, I pay you later? And uh, my thing.
What are those cougars? Swap squill. Yeah, let's find an acorn. Should be around here. It's an RPPVP server, mid small size, but everyone knows each other uh, vibe. It feels like uh, some of the servers, like Living Flame EU, it's like a copy of Gehenna's. And it feels like people from Gehenna's, uh, Wrath of the Lich King, went to Living Flame EU. Got a guild, boys. Hello. <laughs> hey, man. I'll pay you. <laughs> okay. I know how to make friends. That's for sure. Where do we find some of those cougars? There's a cave here. I can go there and farm some XP quickly. There we go. And the cougars are there. You know what we're going to do? We're going to walk to Thunderbluff. I tried to negotiate with a warlock. And I told him, um, Hey, summon me. I'll pay you from my main. And he was like, Nah. You pay me first from my main and then I summon you. And I was like, Okay. Uh -huh. Probably he got scammed a couple of times before, guys. You know, the life of a summoner is not easy. Business is about to close soon. When phase 2 hits, like, mages will get portals. So the summoning business is going to take, like, a huge hit. <laughs> and I told him, man, I'm gonna pay you. I'm not gonna scam you. I'm Frostadam was the streamer. And then he goes, like, I don't know you. And I go, like... That's because you're a filthy gold seller. Oh my god. What's wrong with me? Wow. I told him. Motherfucker. How dare he not summon me? Do you really want to hurt people? Well, listen. Most of those people like summoning and doing that, they're like... Let me put it this way. A lot of people making gold, they're gold sellers. Like more than 50% of them. Because no one is crazy enough to, to farm a lot of gold just for the fun of it. Especially when gold costs like almost nothing. How much does it cost to buy gold nowadays? I don't think it's that much. Let's open an incognito tab. Um, incognito tab, and what do we what do we type there? Gold uh, G two A G two. What's the website G two A G two G two G? 
sounds so cringy. What's what's the? Um, oh yeah, most of the boosters are gold sellers. G, G to G. <laughs> Let's see the gold price on G to G. G to G. Except get boost. What is that website? G to A. What? G to G. Is this the one? Cheap gold for sale. Oh, Kazakh, Aaron Mill. I don't know how to. I don't know how to use it. Yeah, basically, gold gold is probably really inexpensive. You find your servant in faction? Oh, look who knows. <laughs> Cheap potatoes, you're kind of an expert in it. Do you sell or do you buy? So let's say you would be able to farm 100 gold per day. How much is 100 gold? You bought thousands in Wrath of the Lich King. Phase two. Ouch. Gotcha game. <laughs> So you tell me guys, if in the future they make MMOs and they have a cash shop and everyone complains All the cash shop is not good And then the people that complain go and buy gold How do you call that? I don't know how to call that Hypocrisy Hypocrites, huh? The problem is that I think that um, there's a huge part of the community that actually don't buy gold and don't like pay to win, right? So those are the ones that have the voice. Mostly. Uh, a couple of those. So what else do we need from this cave? We need poachers. Oh, there we go. There's a poacher there. There's a tanner here. Tanner from high school. <clears throat> You'd call it poor administration from Blizzard side. Uh, yeah, I guess they could have like... It's both. It's both at fault here. Players and Blizzard. They should have like uh, enforced the rules more often. Like, especially they had an opportunity recently when a big streamer got like um, caught buying gold, soda that popping. He should have like they should have like permanently banned him forever. And that would have been like the best example, right? Then people will be like, "Oh shit, I lose all my accounts in World of Warcraft." Oopsie. I think that would have gave like a great example. But they didn't took that advantage. Like they went like, okay, so that Poppin makes like a lot of publicity for our game. Uh banning him. So they made a business call, business decision, right? Because whenever Soda Poppin streams like uh World of Warcraft, he streams to I don't know how many people man, to everyone. <laughs> That's good publicity. For free. Imagine you ban him. That would show integrity to the company, but you would lose some money. 
Yeah, imagine banning Asmon. Exact. Why? <laughs> like even if if I would run like Blizzard, I wouldn't ever. <laughs> I just pretend like nothing happened. La, 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 la. This might be what actually happened. You know, they were like um, cracking in a bit on bands, and then they they found like, oh shit, this is soda popping, and they went like, boss, boss, look, we we caught like soda popping buying gold. What do we do? What do we do? And they went like, oh shit, well. <laughs> Let's think about it. <clears throat> if Rectal got banned on his main account, oh boy, rip, rip Rectal, mate. I would be curious to know how many customers they would retain in the long term by banning him, though. No real metric to measure that. Yeah. I mean... It would take way more than that for people to restore, like, full faith in, in Blizzard. Like, I kind of restored faith in the classic team. Because, um... Ever since the release of initial classic WoW... In 2019 from the beta. I had fun playing the game. It wasn't only good decisions, but the good decisions outweigh the bad decisions. So, <clears throat> classic launch. 2019 and the entirety of... Uh, it was a success. A lot of fun I had there. TBC was okay but I was really mad that they brought like the boost. And I didn't like it. And... Wrath of the Lich King, it's kind of in the same situation. I still play them every now and then. But I was a bit disappointed about um, the boost. I, I have to be honest. Like in the beginning I was like blind by hype and I didn't really understand what it would do to the game. But yeah, the boost I didn't really like. But then came the hardcore thingy, the servers. I had a lot of fun playing hardcore. Now they release Season of Discovery. So... I do have a fate on the classic development team. But overall in Blizzard as a company, you know, I have my doubts there. It is, after all, like... It's not the small company that it used to be. So what do we do with this um, artifact storage key? And what do we have to do here? <laughs> you still red and rat, but it picked for you in Ulduar. Seems like Ulduar. Oh, prospector pick. Right click near a forge to break. I have no idea what to do. What's that warrior doing, man? What the fuck? Jesus Christ. We have a key and a pick here. Does anyone know what to do here? I got the pick. Use right click near a force to break. Let me try to find a forge here. We got two picks. Wait a minute. Is there a forge around here? It's in the back. Okay. Farm five of those. Okay. Behind the tent. Roger. Oh shit, I'm dying. Ay, ay, ay. 
you know what? I'm going to get um I'm going to get my uh world buff. Can't get summoned by the paladin because we from the warlock because we got ignored. Um <laughs> and we also have like we only have like one summoner here. So we're gonna have to walk there. Gotta have to walk there. Why me? Speaking of walking, I have some feet here. And we are level 7. Let's go, it's not a long walk. Yay! That's it, now what? Turn in all those quests. We're gonna have to... go back. And get a level from there, at least. Easy peasy. Look, Thunder Bluff is there. Who needs to pay one gold for a summon when I can walk there? And while walking there, I'm also making a XP. <laughs> You walk there from Durotar, see? If you can do it, I can do it. It might sound like a tinfoil hat, but I'm quite sure Blizzard just uses this selling gold websites to sell their own gold. You know, I, I, I thought about that too. Because um, sometimes I have like uh, some sort of conspiracy thinking, pa paranoid thinking. So I go into subjects and think like, well, I have a business mind, right? If people buy, like, literally, like, so much gold, how would I do as a company to kind of, uh, you know, make more money? It is probably a tinfoil hat and Blizzard doesn't really sell gold, but... It would be the perfect system, man, to monetize the game even further. You would literally make, like... You know? And you would be able to ban people that actually try to sell gold, and you would sell only your. So not only that you will crack down on bans, you will crack down on bots, you will sell your own gold. <laughs> it would be too good. <laughs> But it's pretty much tinfoil, yeah. I think the Lich King raids are still way better than vanilla. I don't think so. Like, I raided Ice Crown Citadel. And maybe back in 2008, doing uh, Ice Crown was fun. But I don't find it fun anymore, to tell you the truth. My man. Yo, this is oh this is from myself. Ah, oh, so cool, man. Hello, dear dear deal alt. Today I'm acting retarded. So here is something little for yourself. Buy yourself something nice and remember to make me a sandwich. Fifteen gold for a sandwich, boys. Thank you. And here we get like wait. One bag. Two bag. Three bag, four bag. 
Giving plus one agility enchant on cloak for free. Wait, let me check if I have a cloak here. I don't have a cloak. But you know what? I mean, if it's free, I'm gonna take it. <laughs> oh my god. Ah, thanks, friend. Thanks, friend. This is like the lowest item I ever enchanted. Yo, we got the boon. Let's go. Oh boy. Anything else we can buy? Like some elixirs or something early on that would uh, help um, speed up my level? I don't think so, right? This is level 11 gloves. Level 12. Uh, level 8. Ooh, this is going to be good. Level 11 as well. Level 9. So 8, 9. No tip. He said for free, man. He was trying to make skill, probably. I'm not here to tell the person. He was like, I'm giving it away for free. I know what free means. Free is free, boys. Tell them, tell them, tell them. Do we need, like, it's, is that an important rune for, um... Let me check what rune we get for, uh... The reputation. Skull Bash. Uh, Skull Bash is not that important, right? Glory to the home. Eh. I mean... Let's buy a stuff, right? Filter Builder. Uh, weapons. And stuff. Stuff, stuff, stuff. Search. Add... Okay, let's see what kind of stuff we get at this level. Of the boar. Did we get one of the owl? Oh, that's a lot of silver. What the... Guys, what's, what's the prices on the stuff, man? It's just a stuff. This is scam? We are being scammed. Anyway, we don't need this stuff. Where were we? I think we got this one. Let's go use it so we can... Um, I, I don't think we need anything else. We got the bags. We got the quest mobs. Maybe... Hey, weapon trainer. Two-handed maces. Ooh. Let's look for a two-handed mace then. Just the thing for you. Stringy wolf meat. We're not gonna need this. Small eggs. No way. Walk with the, Walk with the earth mother. We could use some buffs, bro. Post auctions. Uh, two handed mace. Weapons. Two handed maces. Let's go. Search. There we go. We have options here, guys. Let's go by price. Gorilla, boar, eagle. I think one of the eagle is perfect. Eight silver. That's what we're talking about, man. That's what we're talking about. Yo, God Mode. Yo, Dreamer. Hello, Guildy. You are Dreamer from the Guild? God Mode. Thank you very much for the raid, man. Big shout to God Mode. Shout. How is, um... How's Wrath of the Lich King raiding, my friend? Going to the gym. Yeah, man, I saw, like, your pictures. You're going crazy, dude. I don't know what to say. But, um... That's, that's like... Really impressive transformation you had there. Wrath of the Lich King is dying. Yeah, I think so, to be honest. How are you doing, Dream Dreamer? I'm fine. I just started a new Tauren. Like, uh, I got the Star Surge rune. I got, like, the world buff. And now we're about to one-shot mobs until they all die. Well met. That's gonna be so cool. We got some bags. We sent some gold. We're ready to have an adventure. We just need to... How may I 
There we go. Man, this this boon makes a difference. I feel faster. Like, I feel like I'm leveling faster just by moving faster. Look at that. What there we go. Level 8. I'm enjoying Sod. I'm looking forward for phase 2, to be honest. You feel 10% faster? At least 10% faster. It could be even more, to be honest. Who knows? Use the totem. Cleanse the... What? Where do we need to go? 17? Here, okay. We have to use some sort of totem to cleanse something. No... Uh, level 8. Let's go. The mace. We equip the mace. And we also equip the new chest. And we put the Fury of the Storm Rage rune on the chest. New pair of bracers. And that's about it. Let's go! You're playing a warrior, right? Dream on. Oh, you're playing a 25 warrior. I need to level a warrior too. But I have a, I have a Rogan plan. Oh, it's fine. This is an alt here. I have like a, a lot of gold in the server. I think I have 1.2k in total or 1.1k. I make some uh, video guides on YouTube about gold grinds and stuff like that. So, uh, gold is not a problem for me. I am very rich. I can afford mountain all the alts. <laughs> Oh my god. It is a huge difference, man, when it comes to... Look at this. 95 damage from Star Surge. So the boon makes a huge difference. I told you, you guys were like, no frost. You have like uh, 1200 gold and buys an 8 silver stuff. Yeah, I don't know what happened to me, man. I became like cheaper. I became like more of a goblin lately. But uh, this is good enough. I mean, two stamina, two intellect. What more do you want for this level? <laughs> but you have a good point, yeah. Okay, buy ice cold milk. Turn winter hoof cleansing. Let's go. Get some arcane rat gear. It's going to make a huge difference. Let me check here. Arcane damage. Arcane damage. This is nature damage. So only star search does uh, arcane damage. It scales one to one. That seems broken. Next time we go to the auction house, or should we log on the mage and check it? Do you even need intellect? The winds guide. I don't think so. Train your class spells. Let's see what we can get at level 8. What brings you here? Roots and healing touch. Alright. We got healing touch rank 2. And roots. Mm. No, let's put it here. Oh, okay. Where do we head it? This way. Straight ahead? Okay, we go this way so we can get the stalker claws. Shaman called Frostbite. You farmed 2500 honor today by killing bots. Uh, where are you farming the honor, though? Because I was wondering, because I was farming, like, Warson Gulch. 
But if you face a pre-made in Warzone Gold, she's not that good for uh, Honor. Wow. Eat the Honor fine boys. This is how I'm gonna make like a rank in the next phase. I'm gonna kill bots. Holy, you're right. <clears throat> Alliance mage bots at SFK. How long did you spend? Do you know the amount of time you spent for getting the 2500 honor? I want to compare to my uh, Warzone Gold winning streak. An entire day. We could do uh, something like Blizzard could uh, increase the honor gain from people that got reported as being bots. So if someone gets reported for being a bot, you suddenly get double honor from him. <laughs> Does that make any sense? Or triple. Or becomes like a, an outlaw and everyone can kill him. <laughs> Even their own faction. <gasps> wow, that's smart, dude. So if you get reported by 10 people that you're a bot. Uh, maybe that's not because it, it leaves like room for uh, exploits. Me as a streamer would say like, okay, everyone, let's take this guy who just uh, wants to loot my stuff. And report him as a bot. That's not PPC, is it? I don't think so. That could be abused. They're already abusing, like, in the Wrath of the Lich King, there's a system, I think even in this game, where you can report someone in the chat. So gold sellers that were um, organizing gold DKPs in Wrath of the Lich King were starting to report the competition because uh, they were stealing, like, their customers from gold DKP. So... They were banning each other, man. So they couldn't advertise in the general chat. Think about that, just for a second. And tell me if that's not retarded. And I didn't use it in a derogatory term, okay? It's definitely not PPC, but imagine like... Gold sellers being mad that someone else take their business. That's like, that's funny. WoW has a system where if enough people report you, you will get banned by auto system. And then God, good luck getting unbanned. Wow. So how many do, do they need to do? Wow. Kind of interesting system. Yo, Wugza! With a Prime Gaming for four months. Thank you very much for the support. By the way, guys, today we're hosting a Sabaton. We've been live so far for seven hours. From which I think half of it was uh, time got by you guys. Maybe Torque with the Prime Gaming. As you can see, each sub adds five minutes to the timer. We currently have one hour and ten minutes left on the stream. If you want to increase that timer, we're going to stay here on the stream for as much as you guys um, want, basically. 24 hours, 48 hours, we're not going to go to to sleep consciously. So we're not going to go to sleep consciously. Oh, we need to get on like on, on the boomy, we need to get tailoring, right? It's kind of a must. This is so easy to level with, uh, with, um, with this. Like, look at that. Star Surge, 98. 98 damage, there's 100 damage, man, at this level. At level 8, by the way. Look at that. 88. Beautiful. It's, it's, this is like... It's time to nerf Hunter. Yeah, that's a good point. Like, Druids are too strong, nerf Hunters, guys. <laughs> Who do you think is gonna get nerfed in Phase 2? They're going to be, as soon as we get to level 40, there's going to be a couple of classes that are going to be, like, 
really, really strong. And a couple of them will get, like, nerfed. I'm thinking that maybe a priest will get another nerf, the healer priest. Like, penance is so strong. It's like three hunters are on one, uh... So, three hunters are attacking one class, and we don't have enough damage to kill him, because the priest can keep him alive. Like, it, it's... And we have, like... I have a lot of burst, man, with my hunter. I have probably the... The biggest burst in the game. Paladins? You think Paladins... To tell you the truth, man, Paladin is like kind of a disappointment, quote marks, compared to other classes. It feels like the Paladins got the short end of the stick. Now, don't get me wrong. It's all fine and dandy. They have Crusader Strike. They have like Divine Storm. They have like Exorcist. But when you see other classes tool tick, uh, when you see other classes like runes, I think even Warriors will be better than Paladins in Phase 2, man. I don't know, it just feels like me like mages are better than paladins. It just feels to me like hunters are better than paladins. It just feels to me like druids are better than paladins. And probably we can find another couple of classes that are better than paladins. You know? Maybe later on it will matter more. Who knows? Paladin abilities does not proc wind fury. That's why I, was, I wasn't doing like a lot of damage. <laughs> Guys, I think it's time for a warrior. It's time for a warrior. As soon as we get this druid to 25 and we run a BFD, we're either gonna roll a rogue or a warrior. Ouch. I think we're, we're making too many classes and we're focusing on uh, the wrong things. Ha! Ah, ah. Ha! If you want to have fun on a warrior, beat the blue weapons and not leaven the, the zone. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Blue weapons and... Uh, not even sure what are the warrior runes. Hmm. But probably I would take the, the blue weapons, definitely. Getting touch. You know what? Let's try to find this, um... We need to find here something called a Demon Scared Cloak. Can we find that? I don't know where it drops from. It's a rare spawn. Ah, so no point in waiting for it, right? Victory Rush. Oh yeah, Victory Rush could work nice with a blue weapon. Fast skills. Definitely. Die and respawn at the spirit healer. Wait, what? You crazy. Whoa, 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 whoa. I didn't want to die. Because I have the boon. Shut up, man. Stupid guide. It's funny that you have to face uh, to cast uh, Sunfire. You have to face the, the mobs. Warrior uh, was the worst leveling experience for me. Most classes have very little to no downtime, and Warrior feels basically the same. Like someone said earlier um, in the chat, you must outlevel the zones. So, um, try to do the dungeons. 
and buy items from the auction house. So it's not your first character, the warrior. Get it the second. And if you buy the blue items and stuff like that, things of the tiger, probably gonna level re relatively fast. But yeah. Warrior like got the short end of the stick. But it's gonna be better at level 40. Uh, I'm gonna level a warrior too, but I have a lot of experience on warrior. Like probably when it comes to leveling, uh, warrior is one of the best class I level. And uh, mostly because uh, I played hardcore, how many warriors I lost, guys? I think I leveled 1 to 30, maybe 50 warriors. <laughs> and then 1 to 60, a couple. Looking for something special? Uh, we have the innkeeper here. Let's see if we can buy something here. Man, can, can you sell something here? We shall meet I, I want to browse your goods. Browse your goods. Earthroot. That probably was uh, worth something. Anyway, they want me to buy ice cold milk, but I never run out of mana. So, whatever. Let's go. Did we level up? New pants at level 9. There we go. Ha! Got him! Next upgrades are at level 11. Season of Discovery is so unbalanced, but, um, I mean, what can you do? If you think about it, Warrior is hard to level, but it is the best DPS class, isn't it? In PV DPS. And the word on the street is that it's going to be the same at level 40 as well. I think Fury is going to pop. Deep Fury, 31 points. Bloodthirst. With Wind Fury. Yeah. Imagine all the gear, because this is the thing, like, people don't understand. You're going to be able to make a full set of the warrior with strength, agility, and uh, strength, agility, and some even attack power items. Which scale now with... Um, Aspect of the Lion and Blessing of the Kings. Kings. I'm not even sure. Does Kings stack with Aspect of the Lion? Does anyone know? On the Lion side? Or you can only have like one. Okay. We go here and we get the Prospector pick. What is this man? The zone and the art color scheme is very calming, but you have to run so much in Mulgor. Mm -hmm. But it does feel like good for a starting zone. Looking good so far. Okay, let's see. We have to get five Prospector stuff here. Hey, 
Hey. We have this key. No! Whoa. <laughs> uh, where's the anvil? I don't know. So you can do two rats into one of these and you kill them up every six seconds. Oh no. Well, sometimes they resist, you know. Let me try to see if I can find the anvil. Someone told me there's an anvil around here. Ah, uh, it's forged there. Let's go try there. And there's a chest. Okay, let's try this one. What now? What is the chest? Uh, chest here? To open with the key? Artifact storage key? Hmm. By the table? Let's see what we have here. By the table. A pair of gray bracers. Let's go. Uh, what do we need now? Witching Talon. Manazaki. Oh, someone killed it. No. Tomorrow we have uh, the Dark Moon Fair. That's going to be 10% damage too. So leveling a rogue with Boon. Dark Moon Fair buff. That's going to be something. Rough stone. Let's destroy this one and uh, get the one with rough stone because we can fill that one. So it seems like this pattern works great. So two rats. One. Two. Almost. Two rats into Star Surge. And you can finish it with... Um... And it's no mana, look at that. Man, what the hell is going on? This is too OP, man. Like, look, I, I, I literally don't use any mana. It's free. One. Two. There's no downtime. It's, it's harder to level a mage. Oh, 
Oh my god. I don't know what to do. It's... Should I report it as a bug? Or should I keep on playing like this? And pretend that everything is okay. One. Two. We don't even need three. Torrent. Oh, we have a herbalism skill, right? Should we... Should we get a uh, herb? I think we should get the herb and use this one to... Urban what on that? Urban tailoring. Level up to 25 and then report it. Listen, the weird thing is that you don't consume any mana, right? And if you use one, two of them and it doesn't die. Well, it does die though. But let's say just by case if it doesn't die. So one. Two. You can use this one, which is instant. And all of the, those three spells costed me 19 mana. <clears throat> Out of mining and fishing on a druid? Really? And what boots do we use, though? Do we use the... the set boots? How are the leather boots? The leather caster boots? Uh, they're not that good. Blizzard is the best. Yeah, I only notice how... Like, if I find a spot, I think it's faster to grind than to quest. We just kill the mob so fast and we don't have any downtime. If you get something over King Rat... Hey, we finished this quest. There's a cave up there. So how do I get to that cave? This way? My god. Oh guys, we got we we went under one hour. We have one hour left of stream. But actually it's 51 minutes. Twitch Prime quickly. Sod is retail on classic graphics. Not really, to be honest. Retail it's not bad because Retail is bad because... <sighs> I had to put it out there. And retail is bad because it's too complicated, man. A game can be fun. Because... Uh... Hey, we have so many. Demon scared cloak. Let's try to go this way. Retail, yeah, it's different. It, it's bad for me, for example, because I like simple games. Like, for example, I'm a big fan of BDO. But BDO, the same, got so overly complicated to the point that I have 100, 200 slots in my backpacks in BDO. And all of them are full and I don't know what to do with half of the items there. So it got so overly complicated that it's really hard, especially for new players. You look at those level 11s, matriarchs. So if I would be at Blizzard, honestly, instead of retail, I would have like deleted half of the everything that is in the game. I would have closed continents. I would have removed like half of the spells. <gasps> Idol. What is this, man? Requires level 10. Wow, those level 11 ones are uh, really tough, man. But so am I. How much XP we get from them? 100 XP per kill, so we need 60 to kill. They condense a lot of the items in BDO. When? Was it recently? I recently played. Um, I played the, during the New Year's, basically, for two weeks or three weeks. During the Christmas holidays and stuff like that. And I'm not joking, but I made in BDO 140 billion silver in two weeks. <laughs> and I was like, what the fuck? I made 100 and billion, 140 billion silver in two weeks. 
And I got my gear upgraded as well. Like, it was so complex. I made a pen ogre. I sold it. It was like 70 or something bill after tax. Um, I made a couple of tet distortions. Wait, we got the buff? You get the buff if you're here? Oh, this location here, it's like... It, it thinks like you're... The game thinks I'm in Thunder Bluff, mate. Look at that. Like, I was exactly there. And we just got our buff refreshed. Dude. What more do you want, guys? I win. You got your dance. This is this is so so crazy, man. But it's only for a couple of levels, right? It's gonna get like Okay, let's go. You only feel it's less damage at like 22, 23. And then at 25, you get like good, good loot, right? You get 100 spell power from BFD. And it's gonna be good again. Wow. What is this? Enforced Emil Guard. Is this the one that drops the quest that we want? No, this is not the one. We need to get this uh, Star Sh Surge. Star Fire. Ooh, this guy has like a lot of HP. Nope. Okay. So we cannot find the, the quest mob here. Let's just go where we, we were supposed to go. We're about to hit level 10 as well, get the first talent point. I'm not even sure exactly which talents we're gonna get. But probably we're not gonna have like hundreds of options. Look, I can clear this camp in like literally 20 seconds. My God. She level up. 
First talent point. Let's see. Well, we're gonna get probably improved wrath. We have nature grasp. While activity, anytime an enemy strike the caster, you have 35% chance to become afflicted by a tangling roots. I don't know the the, the build for uh, for druids, guys. Which one is it? Let me check the casting time for Wrath. Currently it's 1.7, but it's gonna go uh, up, right? Increase the chance of your nature grasp to entangle an enemy by 15%. So 5 Wrath is mandatory. Let's go for that then. Other one seems to be like a PvP. Spec. Makar Makariji, Mak Makariji83, thank you. Hello? I thought you followed. Welcome to the stream, my friend. We can't seem to find that uh, rare ghost howl that drops uh, the thingy here. You watch it every day. Oh, the rake. Um. Well... This is like the spawns quite often. Oh, it's no big deal if I kill it. Line for armor. Green. Can be in two places? Yeah, I looked here, I looked here, and I also looked here. Couldn't find it. Which is fine. Not gonna stress about it. It's just a quest. No big deal. Wait, which one do we have to go first? A sacred bur burial. Waters of the Seers. Okay, we have to go there first, apparently. Greetings. Greetings, look at my bags. No. How to pick a good weapon for mage? I've seen that uh, even one-handed swords player use with off-hand weapon. Well, until level... Um, until level 25, you, you can just get the stuff, pretty much. And then at level 25, when you do BFD, you see what you can get. Sometimes there are some daggers with spell power. And you can find an off-hand as well. That's why I have on my mages a dagger from the last boss in BFD with offhand. On the horde side, there's a nice quest for BFD that gives a good offhand. On the lion side, I guess you have to get lucky with a drop. Or you get the epic stuff from uh, BFD. Until then, either pick a stuff from the auction house, or there's one uh, in Walling Caverns, or one in Dead Mines. Those would be decent enough to get you there. You don't get it? Doesn't drop or what do you mean? Are you Horde or Alliance? And what level do you have? Alliance. Hmm. Yeah, it's harder for Alliance to get one. Dead Mines would be like... Uh, the one to go for. Definitely. Heavy linen bandages haven't learned that
Learn a new ability after keeping your rage in bear form at 50 or higher for 60 seconds. Okay. Die and respawn on the spirit healer. No, what is the spirit healer? 68. Wow, we have a lot to walk. All the way until here. Well, listen. We're gonna walk because we can't really lose the, the world buff. We just got a fresh one. <clears throat> Change a bit of music, wake everyone up. Ooh. What's good to have in an offhand for mage? Intellect or stamina? Intellect and stamina or just intellect? Pretty good. Or intellect and spirit sometimes can work too. Trying to look for that wolf. I don't see to find him. Oh, by the way, speaking of this, stay hydrated. That's very important. And it's already 5.38 a.m. Uh, p.m. Haven't done any workout today. So what we're going to do, we're going to put the treadmill on. One, two, three, four. Let's vendor the trash because we have a, like a lot of it. We have all the trash. Hey. Look at that. It's okay, boys. Take it slow. It's okay. It's okay. Slow, slow. There we go. We're back. 
Turn in the door when digging. Well met. Walk with the earth, mother. Greetings, traveler. What brings you here? Turn in uh let me check how fast we got to level 10. Two hours and 20 minutes. But we're almost level 11 though. It's not that fast, but... We weren't necessarily speeding. Or trying to speed it up. But I guess we can catch up now. If we can, if we can keep it at this pace. Because now we got warmed up. We got into the flow. We got into the zone. And we are moving uh, with a sort of a, sort of a pace. Look, we got new spells. We got uh, Moonfire rank 2, which costs 50 mana. Ow. Wow. And what else we got? Ridge of rank 2, which costs... And Mark of the Wild rank 2. Wow. That's going to give me stats. There we go. Lucky, lucky, lucky me. I'm a lucky son of a gun. I work eight hours, I sleep eight hours, that leaves eight hours for fun. La 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 Turn in the Ravaged Caravan. Okay. We're gonna be level, level 11 soon. We're gonna head over to the Barrens, the Crossroads. Is a caravan though what happens when the timer gets to zero well the stream shuts down we're gonna be back tomorrow if not we're gonna stream more tomorrow guys tomorrow is monday wait what day is today it's a sunday right oh shit today's a sunday How may I... yeah it's a sabaton like um it only goes for we've been streaming for seven hours and 55 minutes from which like uh we started with a timer of how much four hours so uh we have like three hours so far added to the stream. I don't think it's gonna shut down though in 30 minutes. If it is, this is gonna be like my shortest uh, sabaton ever, officially. <laughs> and uh, I don't know, but I need to make some change, man. Changing changes to my stream. Definitely need to look into that. Maybe try to take some time off and try to figure out how to make the stream more entertaining. Because, um, who knows? Are you walking? Yeah, I went a bit on the walking pad. We've been sitting on the chair for the past eight hours. And that's not really that healthy. You have to move after uh, after a long time. You have to. You don't have to walk on the treadmill, but you can uh, leave the chair, uh, go around in your room a bit, like stretch. Stretching is good. Just stretch for five minutes when you're in a flight path or something. Because um, if you don't do that and if you stay too much, even eight hours for me was too much to sit on a chair. It can be really cause like not cause anything. <laughs> It's an unhealthy, let's just say that. So, uh, doing a bit of movement. Uh, what's the situation with the professions? Well, in theory, it should be 2025 to 25. I see no reason why they should modify them, but... I guess we'll have to wait and see. No one really knows so far. I think there are some question marks with uh, Torrens, because Torrens have, like... 15 extra herbalism. So they can gather like higher level herbs, which wouldn't be the end of the world, to be honest. And uh, gnomes would have like advanced access to higher level engineering items, unique ones, which would make them OP in PvP. 
bubbles. Flat Prowler Claw. Where is that one? Probably south there. Oh, come on, just die. I like that some races have an advantage, the herb mining. Yeah, true. Like, I mean, they shouldn't, like, remove that. You know, like, some people say, like, just remove the... Why? I mean, some people have advantages for the entirety of the game, like... Uh, humans have, like, 10% reputation, right? And a lot of items you get from reputation farm. From the boxes, from uh, silver and sentinels. Remove the reputation bonus. No. If they chose to be a gnome, you can let gnomes have the, the, the engineering bonus, but you can remove, for example, uh, the gnomish engineering items. If no one has them until then, that's something else. Just like they removed like the arena grandmaster trinket from, they removed like a lot of other things. Uh, they removed the um, prince nashjack from um, Arati Basin, from, uh, I mean, from Altarak Mountains, no. <laughs> from Arati Highlands, I think. You know the one that drops the, drops the Tidal Charm? It's no, it's no, not, not in game until like, probably next phase. Wow, so if next phase Prince Nashjack is there, shouldn't I park my character? Can I kill it with the Hunter? I don't think I can kill it at level 25 with the Hunter. In the water, or can I? This is interesting because it gets me wondering. Hunter is pretty OP. Yeah. There's another Hoofbird. Hoofbird. Level up, level 11, we can equip one more pair of boots. And we can equip a pair of gloves. And bracers are 12. So let me check what... Uh, gloves, hands, sunfire. There we go, boys. Ha ha ha! Another talent point. One more rat point. Let's see. One. Two. Awesome. What level is Nashjack? I think it's 40 or 41. Uh, it's too high. So it's like Skull at level 25. But at level 35, you should be able to kill it, maybe. Plus, on top of that, uh, you're gonna aggro probably more mobs when you try to kill it. 
So it's gonna be a race to whoever gets there first. And it's gonna be probably a hunter who kills it. There are going to be multiple layers. So that is something we should uh, keep in mind. Wait a minute, those ones we don't need. Those are level 7. Uh, wait. Flat Prowler Claw. No way. Dying respawn at the Spirit Healer. Again? Well, shouldn't we go to fly to Thunder Bluff? Uh, travel to the Barrens. Yeah, we're gonna turn in this quest, and then we're gonna go to the Barrens. We're probably gonna abandon the rest of the quests. We'll see. Disable death skips. Oh yeah, you can do that, right? By uh, setting it up. La, 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 la. Level 11. So far we played 2 hours and 31 minutes. It's still kind of a speed run, but we weren't that fast. Hello snacks. Good evening. To be honest, I think we're ready to go to... Yeah, we're ready to go to Crossroads. That's it? Travel to the Barrens. There we go. That's it. We have a bunch of quests there too. I think we forgot a couple of runes to pick from here. What other runes do we need? Yo, uh, Miss Bell gifting a tier 1 sub to Dicey. Thank you very much, Big Spell. Five more minutes. 26 minutes left, boys. From the Sunday stream. Oh no. We need the Feral runes. Veteran of Anarchy, I just joined. Ha! Huh. I got promoted by Dreamman to Veteran. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. And being a streamer comes with so many perks sometimes. Whenever you make a group, everyone joins your group. Even if you have like uh, reserved items. Whenever you join a guild, you immediately get promoted to Veteran. You know, like... Streamer bennies. Whenever you buy gold, Blizzard doesn't ban you immediately. Well, it depends how big of a streamer you are. If you're like a small one, they go like, Hey, you know what? Shut up. <laughs> Listen, fake UT got banned. So Guide MMO, the YouTuber, got banned for... Not for gold buying. Well, I don't know exactly what he did, to be honest. He says that he traded 700 gold with... Uh, with someone from a different server or from a different expansion because he wanted more gold in Season of Discovery so he gave like, I don't know, Wrath of the Lich King gold or something and then uh, he got banned because of that but yeah <laughs> you also track griefers well, some benefits, some some non-benefits, you know what you mean it's not always benefits, I guess Uh, Guide MMO. It's a YouTube channel. Fake QT. Do you remember Fake QT? That's the guy who got banned. He makes like gold guides on YouTube and stuff like that. What do we have here? Journey to the crossroads. Fly to Thunder Bluff. 
Set your hearts on the Thunder Bluff. Wait, what? Really? Okay. Well, Apparently we have to fight the Thunder Bluff. And set my hearts on there. I guess we're gonna get back. Let me quickly take my plate away, because uh, it's going to... Yo, sir, dude, with the gifted subs. Hey, wait, paying forward the gifted sub from Mr. Slugsnail. Thank you very much, sir, dude, for the gifted tier one sub. Five more minutes. At least I'm gonna get my steps on. <laughs> I wanna really keep this, um. Maybe for the entire year. This workout every day thingy. This audio? What happened? We have a bug. Okay. So I wanna keep for the entirety year this workout every day. Listen, there might be there might be a day off or two days off if I feel so. Um, but maybe something that I, it's planned to take off, not something that is done out of weakness. Like in terms of um, how to put it out there. Like last night, to give you an example, at 11 p.m. I was so broken because I was tired. I had like a long day and so on. And I felt like my body was so ready to sleep and tired and I couldn't move my body and then I, I was like I need to do a workout so what I did I started doing a workout I started with a stretch stretch kind of awakened a bit my body and then I started doing like push-ups 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 then I took a shower after that and I was fresh man I couldn't believe it my eyes what brings you here? like I was fresh I think we might need to take those, uh... Goodbye. Not sure what these ones. Be careful. Testing an enemy strength. Ha ha ha. Now go in. Moonglade. Use a spell teleport Moonglade to travel to Moonglade. Do we use it now? No. Greetings. Cast teleport Moonglade. Ouch. Okay. Easy druid life. What do we do here? Except the great bear spirit. Bear necessities. I'm listening. Oh, my leg. What's going on? Seek out the great bear spirit and learn what it has to share with you. Okay. How long do you walk a day? 10,000 steps it's like six kilometers six plus frost i've never told you thanks for all the content 
Hey, cheers, Papa Bear. Welcome to the stream. Okay, we talk to the bear spirit. And then what? Heart to Thunder Bluff. Fine. Druids are lucky with Teleport Monglade. Makes it easier for a boon. You can fly from there to... Or why? I don't understand. Oh shit, we forgot to set up our hearthstone to Thunder Bluff. No! We forgot last time to set the, the, the hearthstone. Well. Wait, wouldn't it be faster to... No. Balance? I guess we put in Rat, right? Rat, then it's gonna be probably Moonfire. Because Star Surge is a um, Moonfire. Just because you can have the heart on the other continent. Oh, yeah, that makes a lot of sense. True. Hey, Lord Felix. So if you if you read those spells, let me check. Star Surge benefits from triggers most talents that affect Rat and Starfire. So that's one, and then uh, Sunfire. Uh, it's triggered by. I don't know. Moonfire. So any Moonfire talent like this one with crit would affect like Sunfire. So that's good. Hundred DPS per second. How do bumpkins DPS in raid? You just spam breath and star surge. Are you walk, walking and playing? Yes, pretty much. We have a daily 10,000 step um, achievement to do this year. It's not necessarily a daily one, but we try to do it daily. It really gets... Um, Oh, there we go. Red Ribbon Gift. Thank you very much, John Priest. Let's see what's inside. Oh, a Razuk Club, man. But what do we do with this one? Holy smokes. It's a level 16 maze. Oh my god, with three intellect. We use it, right? Did you go exalted with Watson Gulch in any tunes? No, man, I don't have that. Like, I don't have that. That. I don't have that patience, to tell you the truth. Getting exalted with. Um... Thank you very much, Jonah. That's really nice. I'm gonna use this one, but I'm not sure exactly how to play the druid. 
So we're gonna learn. I'm going to get the flight path here in Thunder Bluff. And then I'm going to turn in some quests. Which is this one, right? Back to Thunder Bluff. Then I'm gonna fly to, to Crossroads. Journey to go to Crossroads. Is it this way? Hopefully your internet will cope and work. Oh, you're back? Awesome, awesome. I didn't see what the provider you have. You know what's fun about the... Oh shit, I almost jumped down. I've seen like in a classic hardcore people jumping down from those bridges by mistake. I think with this druid you don't even have to go back and learn new spells. You basically have... Well, you need wrath. Let me check when we get like the next rank of wrath. But that's the only one probably. So at level 14, there's a rank 3. Until then, there's no point to go back and... Orange. Oh, wow. Yikes. You said orange, like an American? Run to the Moonkin Stone. Wait. I think we gotta get something here. Kill Luna Claw. Whoa. You're enjoying Warts and Gulch fun? When you get friends together? Are you queue as a pre-made or as a mini pre-made? Definitely. I did a couple of Wars and Goals today, and we were faced only versus pre-mades, and it wasn't that much fun. I, wa I, just, I just wanted to get like a bit of honor, so I could get the cloak on my hunter. So, run to the Moonkin Stone. Okay. Okay, not sure what this was. 
but we did it. You think they're going to change with pre-made groups? Yeah, I think they already like uh, leaked some couple of things in a tweet. They said about the matchmaking system for Battlegrounds in Phase 2. What is a matchmaking system? And they, they, they talked about something, so I would assume like something will happen. Can't say exactly what. We have some ideas. But um, hey, 10 days left or how much? 11 days until we get phase two. I'm sweating, sweating, baby. Did they say anything related to the runes? Oh, we're supposed to get like a season of discovery. It's supposed to be a surprise. So they didn't send and they didn't say anything about anything. They only like hinted at a PvP event in uh, Strangletorn. We don't know exactly what's gonna be about, but we have a couple of leaks that. Um, so-called leaks. I think you can carry only 20 Watson Gulch marks. 20. In the inventory, yeah. It's not much, but it's something. Do they give a uh, XP? They give a bit of XP, right? But not much. <clears throat> All the mails, the words and goals marks in the mail will be deleted when phase two launches. Yeah, the ones in the mail are going to be deleted, but you can still hold like probably 20 in your bags. That's like close to seven turn-ins. It would be interesting if they would uh, allow you to level in Warzone Gulch. At what pace? If you if you if they allow you to level in Warzone Gulch, listen, because this is actually interesting. If they allow you to level in Warzone Gulch, and you can get like a level every two hours, let's say, it might be a good idea to level in Warzone Gulch, because uh, that way you get too exalted. If you're already like revered, if you're not revered. Maybe that's what we should focus on, at least on the characters that matter. The ones that get the epic bracer to the level 40. Like my mage, oh my god. Those bracers. <clears throat> I still don't feel like getting exalted with Orson Gulch, especially on multiple characters. I can understand one character that it's your main. Maybe it's worth. But imagine getting like exalted on two characters. Wow. Well, if they're going to change the system, maybe. Yeah, one character exalted, two characters revered. <laughs> oh shit. Oh, it's only 13. Boys, we just went under 10 minutes. Mark. So this stream, um, if we don't get any subs, is going to end in 10 minutes. That being said, we did have like so far an 8 and a half hour stream. Thank you very much for the subs today. Thank you very much for the support. Um, if you're new to the stream, thank you very much for the follows. We just hit today 55,000 followers. Oh my god. And we currently still have 420 viewers. 420 viewers. Oh, let's go, baby. Um, there we go. Dusty Mage. Increasing the pain in my agony for another five minutes. So I guess we gotta manage to start and do at least one quest. <laughs> Thank you very much, Dusty Mage. You saved the day. Appreciate that. Five more minutes of agony. 
how about if we do it that I'm gonna stay on the treadmill for the duration of the subathon? Would that be like uh, incentivize people more to subscribe? <laughs> Imagine like a an actual subathon marathon. Then in journey to crossroads. Let me check here. We can get some. Uh, Flatland. Okay. You want to pass out from walking? Uh, well, if you drink a lot of water, I don't think it should be that bad. Blood and thunder for the horde. Okay, let me try to see here. Except a bundle of hides. Where is that from? Uh huh. I saw it. Ah, oh, I've been expecting you. Lotar. Fungal spores. That's it? We don't need anything else? Uh, okay. It's kind of weird, though. Hearthstone to crossroads. Did we even make the hearthstone here? Okay, let's, let's make the hearthstone first here. Apparently, we need it. It's not gonna make a difference. Hey, when do we get the Raptor Thieves as well? I don't understand this quest. It's a speedrun quest. Oh, maybe that's why. We should have used a survival one. Not the speedrun one. Yo, Tiny's Big Adventure. With the Prime Gaming. Let's go, Frost. Let's go. Let's go. Welcome back, Tinies. How you been lately, mate? Five more minutes. We're gonna make it, boys. We're gonna make it. Hey. Let me open a window. got back from the hospital. Had a seizure last night while raiding BFD. Well, it seems like you're okay now. Um. Wow. You're all good. Fine then. Let's go. Hey, this is the first time I find this mushrooms available here. Usually they're not. They randomly call by the house. Well, it's not your time to... Oh shit. Oh shit. Hide. Fuck. Dude, they're here. Close the lights. Did I pay my taxes this year? <laughs> Not yet. 
I thought I had time until March. What the fuck? <laughs> Let me see. It seems to be here to the right building. Doesn't look good, probably. It's like an uh, ambulance. Shit. That's not good, guys. <clears throat> Die and respawn of the spirit healer. Oh my god. I don't have that because I have the buff. I, need, I really need to turn off. How do you turn them off? Options. Dead skips. I skip gossip? No. Uh. I don't know how to put them here. Do you know how to turn them off, Avenger? Show all enable frames. Check for add-on compatibility targeting guide routing. Skip over level steps. Um, look and feel advanced settings. No. Communication steps leveling tracker. I can't find it. Press M should be... What? No, from uh, Rested XP. That's fine. Because sometimes it tells you here to die, but I can't really die because um, I have the boon. <clears throat> you know what's weird? Whenever you said this... Uh, Weird, weird feeling, killing a boss in BFD, then walking up, waking up in your underwear with three paramedics. Outside right now to the next building, there are three paramedics as well. They parked and went into the building. Am I going to lose the buff? Doubt it. Oh no! Help! Everyone is leveling with a boon. I wonder what's gonna be the next buff. From Nomer. The Wreck Boon. Plus 100 spell power. The wrench. Hey. It's actually not a bad idea. There's a new S STV buff, yes. If that's true. And uh, the newest STV buff, it's only going to last and it's going to work on STV. And it's going to persist through death. Basically.
to be honest, I think like the Arrested XP guide, sometimes I think it's kind of outdated. It asks you to walk so much and travel so much, go back and forth. You can just stay in farm mobs with the new runes, like, you don't need to go anywhere. <laughs> Four point five K steps, two point seven kilometers. Almost halfway there. Halfway there. Train two hundred maze, except preparation for ceremony. Turn in at Apocatari Zama. Okie dokie. Okie dokie. I think we forgot to turn in one quest. No, we just got it now. Okay. Preparation for the ceremony. And now... Travel to the Spirit Rise and enter the Pools of Vision. Hi, Ice Pop. How you doing? Train skinning. Just slash played a bit. We were 41 minutes so far on this level. That doesn't seem fast to me. This seems slow. What am I doing? Don't fall for skinning again? Nah. I'm going for a... Uh, herbalism, probably. What brings you here? Back to Crane, what is that? Oh no. Does skinning not make gold right now? Well, I mean, if you skin like level 30 mobs, maybe leather has some sort of value, but no, it's not. It's not gonna make you rich. Maybe next. Not even next. There's so much like um, 
I don't think so. We'll have to wait and see. Oh boy, two minutes left. Two minutes and 30 seconds. Well, I guess I'm gonna finish my steps. And then uh, I'm gonna work on some YouTube. YouTube has been working uh, nice lately. Maybe I, I think I want to bring my back my YouTube to a million views a month. Um, we're close to 300,000, so we managed to resurrect YouTube to make it work. So, um, I think I want to bring it back to a million uh, views a month. Well. That would be nice. What did we learn? We learned burr form, growl, mole. And trash. Oh my god. What brings I seek training. Oh, Kidoki. Someone dropped a, a new buff as well. Your recent guides have been really helpful. Would uh, like to see some more for Alliance? That's what I'm gonna do, I think. So, I think I'm gonna hop on my Alliance Mage. I'm gonna finish, like, uh, some grind spots. Train skinning. No thanks. Herbalism. Where do we train herbalism here? We need to talk to a guy. Oh shit. One minute. Three. Two. Four. Ah. Hey look, we ran exactly into the herbalism trainer by mistake. I like that. Let's go. We can now track herbs. And I think tailoring is going to be our second profession. I'm not going to try to have two of them. I'm going to focus like on one. Now what? We have to go outside. Anyway guys, 30 seconds. 29. 28. It's like the count of new year, you know, like... 20... 25. 24. <laughs> Thank you very much guys for watching today. Um, hope you have a lovely rest of the Sunday if uh, you're from NA or uh, Sunday evening if you're, if you're from EU um, I'm gonna see you next time until next time stay frosty bye bye